One day, everyone's favorite hero, Mario, was out taking his morning constitutional. Oh, look, it's Toadsworth! He's offering Mario and the gang a vacation aboard a luxury ocean liner. Ain't that swell? Saving the world is long, hard work, so they're delighted to take Mario rushes off to tell his friends the great news and pack his bags. They can't wait to set sail. They're kings of the world. Except for... Wait, where's Dry Bones? No! Dry Bones and Birdo are gone! You know, that is an interesting detail. We don't have Dry Bones and Birdo along with us on the cruise. I guess we find them on the island. <laughs> this makes me mad! Mad! So I'm, I, they're going on vacation and not taking me! And after all I've done for them! Bowser is not a happy camper, to say the least. Filled with unquenchable rage, the Koopa King swears revenge. They want a fun vacation? I'll give them a fun vacation, and by that I mean no fun at all. And by that he means a lot of fun, because, you know, Bowser, Bowser's time is pretty cool. Bowser's pretty cool, dude. <laughs> no, Boo was there, there was no Dry Bones and Birdo, but welcome! to the Mario Party 7 solo cruise stream. It feels weird listening to this opening without the animation. Am I the only one that gets that vibe nowadays? I've listened to this opening so many times, but now that I've made an animation for it, every time I hear it, I just... Things feel a little bit empty nowadays. It doesn't... <laughs> it doesn't feel the same. Now, I put blind in the title because this is going to be my first time playing the solo cruise. I've played, obviously, party mode a lot. I I have played 8-player mode a bit. I'm considering doing something really special for 8-player mode. For those of you that have seen some of my other streams, you may remember us doing a, um... What was it? I made it so the chat was able to fight one another. So, I was able to set it so, you know, you guys would join my Discord server. There's different text channels, you would choose a team, and then you guys would be able to play against one another. So I was wondering if you guys would be interested in something like that for, like, the 8-player mode. Or perhaps, maybe when we do party mode, we can do a, um, like, a 2v2 thing, and I'll be one of the players, and then I'll set up the controls so that the second player is controlled by you guys. I, I, think, I think that could be a lot of fun, too. There, there's a lot of different combos we can do. We can have, like... Like, like, four different chats, you know, all against each other. We can do, like, a, a 2v2 where I, I take part of the controller, then you guys take another part of the controller. I think that'd be a lot of fun, but that's me kind of spitballing in my head. For now, we're gonna, we're gonna set our little name here. Unfortunately, there's no icon, but I'll set the, I'll set the Z. Oh. You guys let me know if the, the game audio is looking good. Yeah, yeah, OMG chat was like, yeah, we're gonna get to play together. No! Oh, is there enough room for my name? This happens all the time. Oh, oh just barely enough room. Oh, I pity all of you <laughs> who have names longer than eight letters. <laughs> that can't be easily shortened. Some people's names are, like, longer than eight letters, but they can be easily shortened. Some people just don't, so they have to, like, leave some stuff off. Okay, so we got a lot of options here. Now, I do want to make sure that the mic is set to go, because I, I will be having the mic on during this playthrough. So let's make sure that the mic is on and good. Okay, I think it is. Yeah. Let's test the mic. Ah! Oh! Okay, I think it's good. Alright. We, we got the mic going. I, I don't want to... <laughs> I don't want to play through all this and not give you guys, like, the mic minigames and stuff. As stupid as I think some of the mic minigames can be in being able to double your coins and everything, I, you know, I, I think it'd be best to use it. The rumble won't really matter in this case, so I'm just gonna... In some minigames it matters, but in this case, I, I won't really be using it. And we got that B minigame, stereo won't really change anything, so... We got our settings set, we can head off to Solo Cruise. Which, again, I haven't played before, but from the little I've seen, it doesn't seem like there's anything, like, huge, like, about it. I mean, it looks cute, but I don't know what any final boss is, if there's any cutscenes in the middle, or anything like that. 
Uh, yeah, you can tell me how to play. In this mode, you play against a single foe in the board of your choice. You can play against either a CPU character or a friend. To play against a friend, choose the first. Thank you, Toadsworth. I, I thought he was going to tell me about... <laughs> I thought he was going to tell me about something else. Am I not able... You guys can let me know. Am I not able to set the difficulty for the CPUs I fight in this one? Because if that's the case, then I'm, I might have to do this, like, one-handed to make this a little bit more difficult. Are these guys just going to be set to easy mode? <laughs> that's going to be a little... That's going to be a little unfortunate. We've got... Yeah, you don't think you can. Yeah, okay. Do we want to change... Alright, guys, what do we want... What do we want our pre-game message to be? Okay, wait, 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 no! No, I want to set my message. Okay, hold on, I want to set my message. Yeah. Oh, wait, no! Crap! They, they put the no on the left side, so I got confused. Don't worry, I got this, I got this. I got this time. Yo, okay, okay. Alright, alright, alright. Alright, let's see. Alright, guys, what, what do you guys got for custom messages? Give me, give me some ideas. Give me some ideas. All right, so we got the pregame message. It should be you suck. Uh, I am going to bust. Uh, I mean, that, that that sounds fine. I mean, like you know, like bust them open. You know, like win. Like, you know, that, that's pretty fair. We got Morbin time. We got Mario Party. You know, my Mario Parties are pretty straightforward. Hit the bell. I'm, I'm not really sure. It doesn't feel. <laughs> Identify this. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why I didn't find this. I thought it sounded so funny. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, thank you for the donation so much. Like, I appreciate it, dude. You too. I said you too to you saying thanks for the content. That's the equivalent of the waiter giving you your food and then you say you too. Oh, hey, Stinky. Oh, you guys are so right. Look, all the other ideas were just as... Um, of the same quality, but Hey Stinky truly is above the rest. Hold on. It's even canon to Mario, too. Yeah! Okay, okay, we're good, we're good. Okay, okay, we got Hey Stinky. Alright, how about, how about the winning one? How about the winning one? Let's see. Alright. We've got... Thank you, Scooty! For becoming a member, it really helps out the editing fund. I gotta get people to help me editing these videos, dude, so I don't get killed. Ugh. Okay, we've got Loser. Uh, Take a Shower. L. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> so you, you just want L. <laughs> There's something about the simplicity of that one. Something about... L plus ratio. <laughs> just L. <laughs> just... There's something about... There's something about just the L. Alright. We've got Hey Stinky and L. <laughs> Funny how the winning message is L. <laughs> I'm imagining winning a game against anyone else. And you're just like... <laughs> L. That's it. Okay, we don't want to change the message anymore. They keep flipping the no and yes on this. It's starting to upset me. Alright, we're going to start with Grand Canal. I don't... Oh, okay, so we're gonna unlock each of them in order. So we're gonna start Grand Canal, Pagoda Peak, Pyramid Park, Neon Heights, Windmillville, and then Bowser's Enchanted Inferno. See, what's cool about the live streams here is I'm able to go over some stuff that I got wrong, because I did get some things right. <laughs> I love the sticky thing, dude. But I did get some things wrong in the uh, in identifying luck that some people corrected me on in the pin corrections comment, and I'm gonna be able to go over some of that. At some point, I kind of want to make a small corrections video for identifying luck once the series is kind of like over and I get through everything I want to and I'll section it out into the different Mario parties and kind of go over what I got wrong because some people are looking at the video and saying oh well zooms like said this right but what I said was wrong right and I don't really feel good about that so I want to make sure I provide the most accurate information now I want to go up against uh, someone that you guys want me to go up against because look if I go back and forth here I can eventually get someone. So, who do you guys who do you guys think we should go up against? I'm just going to keep going back and forth, honestly. Like, because you can go back and forth and go up against people you have unlocked, I believe. I don't think you're able to go up against uh, Dry Bones or Birdo. It doesn't really look like it. So, I'm going to keep going back and forth here. Okay, here, here's how this is going to work. Uh, the first person that I see, starting now, with a Z at the beginning of their username, will determine it. 
That's how I'm gonna decide. I don't see any Z's in the chat right now. Is that Z at the beginning of their username? Okay, I see Zerok there. Yoshi, we're already on Yoshi. Good job, dude. Yeah, we got we got some bias in here. We got some bias. Does that upset you? Does that upset you? <laughs> we got Yoshi. It's okay. He was already on there. I don't know if you said Yoshi because you already saw him. And you felt bad if we left him. Okay, we're only going up to two stars, so this is going to be a bit interesting. We won't have to, like... Ooh, I haven't heard this music before. Even when I was gathering music for the... Like, for the for the party. I, I haven't heard this one before. Welcome to Grand Canal. The lovely town features balloons, waterways, and gondolas. I tell you about this board. Okay, guys, look. I know you guys are a little new to Mario Party, so let's just... Let's make sure we get this all out of the way. Get two stars before your opponent to win. Easy as tea. So because there are two stars, it's probably going to be a, um... A, a, we're not going to have to keep track of the star cycle, essentially. Honestly, it looks like here with Solo Cruise, we're going to basically cruise right through. It's not going to be that big of a deal. <laughs> if, if I'm being quite honest with you guys. Getting two stars, we're probably going to shred through this thing in an hour and a half. I, I think the stream is probably going to be over in the next hour and, like, what? 44 minutes, it looks like? I don't think you mentioned this, but you can hit the same player twice using the Fireball Orb if they pass you. Oh yeah, like if you stay still, the snack fun. Yeah, if you stay still and then they go in front of you. We're, we're, actually, we're probably gonna see that. We're probably gonna see that this time around. So when you reach a star space, pay 20 coins and the star is yours. Yeah, yeah, we get it, we get it. Be the first to get two stars and you're the winner. Okay, here we go. Okay, well it's just, yeah, just screw me, I guess. <laughs> I was gonna, I was gonna build up anticipation for my dice roll, but we just start off with 10, <laughs> and then we even get a chance. Oh my gosh. I don't know if that's predetermined or not. Oh my lord. This Okay, so this is the furthest away the star space could have possibly been. There's no star space that could have been further. <laughs> I'm over here saying this won't take any time at all, and then it spawns in the furthest possible spot. Well, uh, and look at his dice roll. Okay, Yoshi's trying to really prove us wrong. I don't know what the, um... Actually, what's interesting here is our placings aren't showing up, so I'm interested what the item shop is going to show. Did you get a mushroom? Yeah, I got a mushroom. Interesting. So our placings aren't showing up here, so what's the item shop going to show? I'll, I'll know by the time I get there. Like, once I arrive at the item shop and I look at the pricings, I'll be able to tell what placing it's going by. Wouldn't it be interesting if it went by, like, third or fourth place or something? Okay, well, I'm in 10th right now. I should start seeing some mushrooms if this is going the way I think it is. Yup, there they are. <laughs> there they are. You're our mushroom lads. Now, for those of you that recall, if you haven't seen Identifying Luck yet, obviously, you should probably go watch it. But mushrooms, according to the game's code, have a 0% chance of showing up in the item shop. But the way the game actually works is if it rolls for an item that you cannot afford, it substitutes it with a mushroom, right? So that's why we see two mushrooms here, because both of these are items I can't afford. So according to the item table, these could be like maybe a super mushroom, a pink boo, twister. We really don't know, but at the end of the day, they're mushrooms. So it's going by first place, by the way, in case you were curious. If there's anyone here that's gathering data or anything like that. <laughs> Because I know some people here are like, oh, I like watching the streams and like, you know, keep a track of, ooh, five coins per time we land in the, and no mini game, No mini game? Holy crap. This is going to go by in a breeze. I almost feel bad. Oh, oh, thank you for the super chat earlier, by the way. Please do not underestimate Yoshi, my worst mistake. You'll be fine. What is that? Was that like a coin block? I haven't seen it. I haven't seen that before. See, th this is kind of interesting, honestly. Because you guys know that I know a bit about this game. But, like, I haven't seen a lot of what this has to offer. I kind of like going through the solo mode. And some people say, like, oh, I really wish that you... I can... Well, real quick here. I want to make sure I don't overshoot the star. Okay, it's very unlikely for me to overshoot this thing. Okay. Uh, one small mistake I made, by the way, just so I don't forget it, is that when you use an orb, it's not like 1 to 10 coins, like I said. It's about 2 to 5. That roll is a little too high. I didn't really like how high that was. 
Well, maybe. Let's see. Okay, we got 10 coins out of it. Alright, now I like that I got a high roll. Let's see here. If I... So I have a 9 right now. Oh, with the party crashers? Oh, yeah, sure. They look like a lot of fun. 7, 8, 9... Oh, I've seen I've seen a little bit of their stuff. Now, now, granted, I don't I haven't like watched a ton of, like of their videos and content, so I don't know the names of everybody. But I think I think it'd be a lot of fun. Okay, so we're up to thirty. Okay, but yeah, what I was saying earlier was that it's uh, about like I think it's like one to five or two to five whenever you throw an orb. Like those are the chances of the coins. I said it was one to ten. I was incorrect at the stake. Okay, but now you see that there's no mushrooms, right? And why is that, chat? Why are there no mushrooms? Because I have 30 coins, and the most expensive an orb can get in this game is 30 coins, so now there is a 0% chance of mushrooms showing up at the item shop. I am not referring to slow mushrooms, or slow shrooms, or super mushrooms, or metal mushrooms, okay? Don't be like that. <laughs> Alright. Let's, uh... Ooh. I don't... Getting a hammer, bro, feels like a total waste of time here. Can you imagine getting a hammer, bro, when there's only one person else on the board? Like, why would I pay 10 coins to throw down this orb space, right? On this very short board we're about to play on. Nah, nah, I'm not gonna do that. I don't want any of those. I probably could have grabbed the slow shroom. But, uh... I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna not for now, in case something kind of snipes me. Look at him! And now he's throwing down a hammer! Almost to spite me! It's almost like Yoshi did that to spite me. There were the three coins, by the way. Yeah, no, stars are 20. But, like, <laughs> I'm like, who would throw down a hammer bro orb like this? And then Yoshi's like, hmm, I will. <laughs> oh, God, now he's going to duel me out of everything I got. Give me warp pipe dreams. I would love to show warp pipe dreams on stream. I think that'd be a lot of fun. The slot of stupendousness. Oh, boy. What do we got? Oh, yeah, I can't even see it because it's all question mark. Please. Campu Kiki. Okay, this should be an easy one. This is just one of those ones. Race against your foes, you make your way through the obstacle course. Move and jump. If you don't get out, if you fall, you lose valuable time. No, I thought if I fell, then I'd go far ahead. Can't wait for Mario Party 8. Didn't find luck. Enjoy the heat solo cruise for the time being. I appreciate it. I'm looking forward to the solo cruise. I'm curious if there's anything else. Okay, I'm gonna try and swamp this Yoshi real quick. Eh. Could have saved more time if I went in the middle there a little bit. There we go. I am not used to being on the right side. Time save. Remember, if you jump onto the first log, then you save your time. Oh, thanks for becoming a member, by the way, Bellyoin. If I said your name wrong, you can make sure to let me know. Yoshi sucks. Holy crap. What is he doing? Yoshi. Homie. <laughs> I'm just interested. Sometimes I like watching the AI. Because, like, he was able to fall in between the cracks there, but he just... I'm curious if he's gonna fall here, if he's gonna, like, mess up on the on the stairs. That's not possible, right? Okay, no, he's fine. He's okay. <laughs> You're gonna go left? No, he went right. I love how robotic they move. I love how... You saw how Yoshi didn't veer to the right? He kind of just went one direction and then bolted, like, directly to the right. It was ex it was very angular. <laughs> it's not... It's not respectful. It's not... It's not or, I'm sorry. Um, uh, a Freudian slip. It's not disrespectful. Okay. Oh, interesting. So it looks like we're... Okay, cool. Yeah, no. Yeah. That's fine. There it is. There it is, everybody. There's Mario Party 7 for you. There's Mario Party 7, dudes. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna use this mushroom and, and move on. <laughs> and so it begins. Oh my gosh. Alright, we use the mushroom. It'll help us. I hate the dud so much. I can't ignore that, man. All of the work into that minigame and it's just a screw you. Even on this mode, like, in this mode, we're both, like, right next to each other and placing. Why don't they remove the dud for solo? Oh my god, dude. It's so frustrating. I don't get it. Dude, it, like, it's not, that wasn't the worst scenario. It's not like you had a star for me to steal or anything, but it's still frustrating. Because, like, you work all your way through this minigame, and, like, some people are like, Ah, whatever, dude. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna try, oh my god, we're about to land on Bowser. And I got a Koopa. Ah. 
I didn't even get an orb that I wanted. Ugh, thank you. <laughs> he has an arm. Holy crap. Dang, he threw that far. Holy crap, Brady. Yo, he threw that so far. <laughs> that was like the farthest away he possibly could have thrown that orb. What is this, dude? <laughs> okay, uh, he's probably going to hit me, yeah, with a single player Bowser. I was expecting that. Okay, well, you don't have a star. Honestly, I don't have much to lose. Even if I lose all my coins, I don't have a star. Oh, wait. No, I do have a... I'm so stupid, dude. I just got a star. What am I thinking? The dud really screwed me over, man. Tunnel of Lava. I think this is the the easiest one. Yeah, this is the easiest one. Honestly, the, the names, they all end in an exclamation mark. I don't really... <laughs> they don't really ring in my head that much. <laughs> All right, Tunnel of Lava, this one is extremely simple. I could do this one with my eyes closed. In fact, I'm gonna... No, I'm not. I'm not gonna do it with my eyes closed. Well, now I am. I lost it. I'm opening my eyes. It's okay. <laughs> I'm scared, dude. I'm scared I don't want to lose a star. <laughs> Maybe next time. <laughs> You know, the moment I closed my eyes, I instantly got so much respect for people who do speedruns with their eyes closed. Because <laughs> every time, are the VODs going to stay after the stream is done? Oh yeah, of course, always. <laughs> you know, like, because I've seen some, like, speedruns with people who put blindfolds on, and sometimes I think to myself, huh, they have to do a lot of practice for this kind of stuff. I wonder if I could do a blind one of a game I know a lot, like the Mario Parties, right? And then the moment I closed my eyes, I instantly gained a lot of respect for the people that do that work because I'm like, I don't know where I am. <laughs> oh, man. Toontown! Am I the only one that gets that vibe? I think this came before Toontown, but I always associate the, like, the little circle void. The little circle void with all that stuff. You think it's stupid that you don't even have to destroy all of them? Yeah, I think it is too. I think they should move more, honestly. Because when you're staying in the same spot, those little, you know, Mecha Koopas are able to just... They keep running into you over and over again. So if you find the right spot, you're good. Uh, where's Yoshi right now? Yoshi does not have any orbs. Right? Okay, so uh, here's a good example of a setup. Now, you guys might find it annoying, but every time before the board section, in every identifying luck that has items, I have a disclaimer for the most part. I think maybe just the orb and capsules one. But I have a disclaimer where I talk about the... Like, there's a billion situations in Mario Party. Like, if you're watching Identifying Luck and you think you're going to come out a master, it's not just that, you have to know the intricacies. So, for example, if I'm throwing down, let's say, a Mr. Blizzard orb, there is no point to me throwing it down right here. And that's because Yoshi currently does not have any orbs, and there's an orb space right here, right? And there's not really... Throwing it past the junction here allows Yoshi to, you know, choose a different path after he gets this orb to avoid his orbs, you know, getting stolen or whatever, right? Now, that makes it so the best place for me to place it would probably be, like, around here, unless I wanted to save it. I would I would be considering the bonus stars right about now, but right now we're doing a solo cruise. Yeah, it doesn't even show the Bowser time thing. Turn 4 of 30, yeah. But right now, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna throw it down right here in case he rolls, like, a, like a 4 or so just so so I, I guess the bridges here are more viable because there's no bowser time right that's the only thing that we can really think about it looks like the star spaces haven't really been messed with as well <clears throat> there will be a lot more like a lot more of that once we get to the actual party mode i think this is over except no i rolled a little too high so let's see what we got here five six seven i'm gonna land on bowser again dang no matter where i go Holy crap, no matter where I go, I land on Bowser. And it's because of the stupid coin block here. This coin block wastes a space. Or it doesn't count as a space, right? I, I have a 7 here. 3, 4, 5, and then 6, 7. It doesn't matter which way I go. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, well, in that case, let's take a let's take a look at the item shop here. It's gonna... Yoshi's definitely got that star. He might win this, actually. I'm a little scared. I'm gonna... How many... I did not mean to do that. I wanted to check the map. That's okay. Maybe I need to save some coins just in case, you know, some stuff happens. I should be fine. Because where... If Yoshi gets the star next turn, that'll be totally good. 
because no matter where the star spawns, I'll be in the, a better position to get it, right? A problem would be if Yoshi doesn't get the star next turn, and I have to commit myself to one of the junctions, not knowing where the star is going to be. That's the lose condition. I might actually lose in that case. Are we going to do Tunnel of Lava again? I have a feeling. Oh, no. Treasure Dome. Okay. Again, this one's extremely, extremely easy. It, this one is not hard. It always comes down to the wire. Look at that. Who, who's playing that in the preview? Reggie? Reggie, are you play, Are you there? Are you playing that in the preview, dude? I love Reggie, but uh, from what I saw him playing Smash, I don't know if he's the best at video games. If you're watching this, Reggie, I'm sorry. I love you. <laughs> See right here. Close eyes. No, I can't. No, no, I can't. Look, you guys got to give me some practice. You guys, you guys got to let me... You, give me till next stream. Next stream, I'll start doing some of them, I swear. <laughs> or maybe next board. This should be fine. Ooh, I'm getting really bad RNG right now. Ooh. It should still be fine, though. Ooh, really bad RNG. Holy crap. Jeez. That was some really... Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I cannot emphasize how bad that RNG was. That was really close. Like... I, I forgot what percentage I said. Feel free to remind me of my own words in identifying luck. But I believe to get the worst RNG to guarantee a loss is like 1.2%. You can lose before that, but that's if you're not pathing properly. Like, you want to make sure that you start from the outside, work your way in, go to the closest one. If you're not pathing properly, your chance of winning is like, or losing is like 5 to 10%. But if you're pathing properly, like I was there, I think I might have messed up a little bit. Yeah, 1 in 120, it was something. It was something stupid like that. Okay, what we're hoping right now is for Yoshi to roll a really high number. Oh, no. I don't think that was enough. I really want him to... Could he have even gotten to the star? No. I'm freaking out, dudes. I need to roll low. I need to roll like a 2 or a 1. Honestly, even if I roll to the happening... The reason why I'm afraid right now, you guys, is because... Yoshi's gonna grab this. Here are the possible star spawns. So, the star can spawn right here on this blue space. It could spawn right here. It's around the middle of the screen. So, like, right here on the ledge. Right. It can spawn right over here. And it can also spawn right here, which I did not have on the, the map. So, I, I forgot to put it on the map. I knew it was there. I show it in the video, and I still didn't catch it. But there is a star spawn right here. Star spawn around here. Star spawn around here. And there's a star spawn down here, but this one was already gotten. So... There's probably one I missed, but that's why we're worried about this, because he's going to get this. If I commit myself to this upper path, right, and it turns out the star spawns right here, he's going to get it. That's a little... Oh, I got a 10! Holy crap. Okay, 5, 6, 7, 8. Duel? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. What I am going to do, if I commit myself... I'm going to... It's gonna, if I land right here, it's gonna skip me, because the star won't spawn here. It's, I'm, I'm gonna star block it. Again, for those of you that don't know, if you were standing on the spot, right, where a star's about to spawn, it'll skip to the next location. So if I stand right here, it's just gonna skip to the next one. It could spawn, oh man, this blows. And it's not gonna spawn right here, and it's not gonna spawn up here, so taking this path here probably isn't the best. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna... I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna duel. I'm gonna get an orb. I'm gonna duel him. I'm gonna hope I can land on the happening there. Hope I can land on the happening there. I want. I want to duel him. I want to see if I can reduce his coins a bit. And I'm also gonna hope I can land on the blooper happening. Either of the two. And hope that the star. If he does. If I. If this doesn't work out. If the star. I, I'll hope that the star actually spawns right in front of me. No, not done two incoming, please. It'll be okay. I don't need to take a star from him or anything. Bridge work, okay. This should be fine. Oh, I always mix this one up with give me a sign. They're so similar. What you'll notice is that in a lot of Mario Party games, the duels are either reused, like in Mario Party 8 and Mario Party DS, or they'll tend to uh, just reuse the little... Actually, I want to focus here. I, I want to make sure I don't. I'm going to try jumping on him. CPU suck when they're jumped on. There you go. <laughs> Done number two incoming. <laughs> it's okay, it's okay, guys. Don't worry. We'll get through this together. We'll get through this together. We won't get a second dud. We won't get a second dud. Oh, okay, okay. 
That was enough. That was enough. That wasn't all of his coins, though. Oh, that wasn't all of his coins. The reason why that's still bad is because if he... If he stalls for another turn, unless he lands in the red space, if he stalls for another turn... Oh, no! He got coins from that! No! He got coins from it! No! He's so smart! He watched the video! <laughs> Crap! Oh no, even after all my efforts. <laughs> if the star spawns right above, we're freaking... No, no, no. Actually, maybe the star spawning really close one would be good, because he doesn't have enough coins for it. Oh, come on, please. Please. These two players are neck and neck. Thank you, Toadsworth. <clears throat> oh, screw me! Oh no! Even if I... Even if I went that direction, I'd be one space ahead. Oh, crap. Oh, crap! Why does he have 20 coins from that, too? Oh, no. Dude, he lucked out so... I even won the battle minigame. I did everything I could. Okay. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two. 20, 21, 22. What are the odds of him? Oh, my gosh. Three, four... He needs to roll a 5 or higher. I have better odds at rolling a 2 and then hoping I... Oh, no. Oh, my gosh. That's crazy, dude. No, you guys are right, the Flutter one. I underestimated Yoshi. No, I need to get a thick roll. Ooh, very good start. Ooh, very terrible. Ooh, man, that's a mediocre roll. Let's go! Holy mediocre, baloney. Nice five. Yoshi's gonna kill me. Oh, Yoshi, you freaking... Oh, is there... Oh, a two? Nice. I was hoping you would roll a one, then. No, I can't stop him. I can't stop him. I can't stop Yoshi. If I roll a one, I can do it. Wait, no, hold on a second. If I roll a one, two, three, four, five. If I roll a... Wait a minute, okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, wait. I, I have a 30% chance of getting on a duel. That's pretty good odds. No! No! What the frick is this gonna do? <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Um, um, if... If Yoshi rolls low, so like 20% odds, then I have a chance of rolling a 1 or like a 4. Oh my god, we just gave him more coins. <laughs> Yoshi, come on. I won the mini games, Yoshi. This isn't how it's supposed to work. You're making me look like a fraud. 1 or 2. 1 or 2. 1 or 2, come on. Don't make a fraud out of me. Yeah! Okay, come on. <laughs> come on. <laughs> Come on, I just need to land on the- But if I land on the duel, it's not even guaranteed. I need a one- That is so freaking stupid. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, hold on. Alright, so I need one for a duel there. Three, four. I need a five. A, a, a multiplayer Bowser minigame would really help out. Oh, no. I need to land on the duel. Oh, no. I landed on Bowser, but is it going to be a multiplayer one? It's not going to be a multiplayer one. Who am I kidding? They screwed me. They screwed me. Oh, no. This is so dumb. They don't do multiplayer in two, three. I don't... This is what's so terrible about me doing freaking solo crew. Slot a whirl. Screw you. I want to lose this. I can't believe Yoshi just clobbered me. He made me- Dude, this stream's gonna be longer than I thought. I'm a fraud. Unless he just says no. That'd be pretty cool. That'd be pretty cool. It's so over, dude. I don't even know if Solo Cruise has a difficulty, dude. Screw Yoshi, man. He's so dumb. But you'll notice as I'm button mashing here that it guarantees that I get on the first key. 
because if you butt if you button mash enough, it, it'll eventually land on it. And with this last one, I don't take anyone seriously if they say they can time it. Don't even try to time it. You have better odds just mashing it and hoping for the best. It's essentially luck based, but like you have a 95% chance of winning. Hey, so I'm gonna blame the people here who uh who said to set L as the winning catchphrase. Who sets L as a winning catchphrase? Why did we think that was a good idea? That cursed us. We need to go back and change it. That's what I'm thinking anyways. Come back and see me again. Oh, we had every opportunity. We had every opportunity. Yoshi's opened my eyes to Solo Cruise. He even got a one. Wait a minute. Will the game end or does it end after he after his turn's over? It'll probably end right here. Once I... Yoshi. Can I quit? No, Toadsworth. Uh. Guys, look, I, I showed you the winning thing. Advance, whatever. Whatever, man. I landed on three Bowsers. Sometimes it'd be like that. I'm gonna kill this guy. Look at how sad Mario is. <laughs> Mario's like, I, I thought if Zoomzike like was playing me. I thought if Zoomzike was playing me, I would win! I thought it would work! Bang! 125 cruise mileage points! Can we even buy anything with that? Can we even buy anything with that? Hold on. Was that, was that just a pity amount of cruise points that they just gave us? Let's see if we can even purchase anything. What do we got here, homie? You made a good show! I like how Toesworth is just always where you're trying to go. I love the dance here. Okay. Yo, we gotta unlock them. <laughs> we must release him. <laughs> and we, we gotta get both of them. We must release him. Can I even buy anything with this? No. So they just gave me a pity amount. They're like, eh. Free them. <laughs> we must free them, you're right. Alright, we're gonna try this again. This time I'm gonna prioritize the flutter. I got the golden shroom because... I totally, it totally slipped my mind that, wait, Yoshi only needs to get to two stars. That this isn't a case of party mode or party cruise, whatever it's called in this game, where you have to wait till the turn ends. Because I saw it said 9 out of 30, but I keep, it kept slipping my mind that once you get to two, it's over. Like, that's it. So I have to keep that in mind. Alright, guys. But we have to change. We have to change it. Corsi! Or Chorsi! I don't want to be that guy that mispronounces the name, so I'm going to say both of them, and one of them will be a mispronounced, one of them will be right. Thank you for joining the Zyke Editor Fund. I really appreciate it, man. All right. Okay, hey, Stinky. <laughs> Bye, Stinky. <laughs> I don't know why that one made me laugh so much. Bye, Stinky. <laughs> why am I saying bye when it's the first thing that's said? <laughs> why am I saying bye when I just see them? Bye, Stinky. Yeah, there we go. Okay. We have to change it up a little bit. Maybe it didn't work. Okay, guys. L's not working out. Now, okay, now this, this this might be a little controversial. Okay, what if we change it from L? To L. What do you guys think? <laughs> what do you guys think, dude? <laughs> it's hidden. It's hidden in disguise. For those people who join the stream afterwards, they're just gonna be like, why is the winning message I? And it'll just be between us. It'll be between us. It's actually an L. <laughs> no one will know. I want my rematch, bro. I want my rematch. <laughs> I'm not gonna underestimate you this time. We're going straight there. You know what's interesting about this, though, is we're gonna be able to find out right here and now the, uh, how the star space works, right? Because if the star spawns in the exact same location and it starts repeating itself, we can just predict it and end this early. Or it might be random. I guess we're gonna, I guess we're gonna see. You'll also notice that there's a lot more dual spaces that replace the, uh, the blue, he's going first again, that replace all the blue spaces too. The fact that he's going first really screws at this too a little bit. 
Because in something like this, where it's so short, going first feels like it's more significant. Normally, going first doesn't really matter in the grand scheme of things. Okay, it is different. Normally, going first doesn't matter in the grand scheme of things, because the game's so long, it kind of... It's whatever, right? But when it's just you and another person, and it's such a short game... And he rolls, like, high like he did last time... Hammer bro, there it is again. I'm really curious if the orb spaces are a little bit different, too. I, I know that the dual spaces are about the same here. It definitely looks like that. Alright, so after Yoshi made a mockery of me, I'm about to land on a Bowser on the first turn. <laughs> Has Yoshi landed on Bowser once? Has he landed on Bowser once? That's a rhetorical question. The answer is no. <laughs> yeah, there's no way there's a multiplayer one, dude. It's just single player here. He hasn't even landed on Bowser yet. If I can't... Oh, half my coins. Oh, man. Oh man, half my coins. Treasure dome. Okay, let's hope we don't get bad RNG this time. I want to beat this in record time. Or maybe we can get like the .80%. Honestly, it sounds weird, but even if something is really unfortunate, as long as it doesn't like, you know, hurt me or the people I love, if it's extremely unfortunate, right, and it's a one in something chance, I still think that's considered maybe not lucky, but like considered kind of cool, right? Like, obviously, if you get hit by lightning, I'm not going to be like, Holy crap, you identified those odds! Uh, or identified that luck! You know, I'm not going to I'm not gonna say that if you get hit by lightning or anything, right? But, like, at the same time, after you get hit by lightning, and you're totally cool, I'm not saying if you get hit by lightning and you, like, die instantly. Let's just say you get hit by lightning and you, I don't know, maybe get lightning powers or something. Or, or, or you get hit by lightning and maybe you're fine. And then you're in the hospital... I walk in there, and I'm like, okay, homie, you got hit by lightning, like, two times in a row? That was really lucky, man. And you're gonna be like, yeah, that was pretty lucky, wasn't it? <laughs> like, that was, uh, how'd you do that two times in a row? <laughs> I'm the only one that thinks that, like, when something really unfortunate happens, and it doesn't hurt you. Okay, maybe get, okay, getting struck by lightning would hurt, right? I, I think, I, I think we can agree that would, would it, though? Would it actually hurt? I'm just saying, like, I'm not saying that if I got struck by lightning, I'd be like, holy crap, I'm the luckiest guy alive. I'm just saying, if I got struck by lightning one day, right, and then I walk, like, maybe a mile, and I get struck again, at some point, I gotta think to myself, man, I'm really lucky. Like, that's, like, one in, like, a thousand odds two times in a row. That's pretty cool, you know? You know, I, of course, I'm not happy about the fact that I probably, you know, got hit by lightning. Yoshi is too far away for me to zing him with this. I'm gonna put this right here. There's one guy who got struck seven times. <laughs> You're not sure how I would think anymore? You know, maybe that would explain... Maybe that would explain why... Oh, DK! Right after... Right, right out the bat. Look at that. That's pretty cool. Would you guys not? Look, easy single player. I'm not trying to endorse being struck by lightning. Here's the thing. If you're trying to get struck by lightning, that's different. I'm saying if you're just walking around, minding your own business... Oh, he won't give a star. Interesting. If he won't give a star here, I wonder how the other happenings here work. Huh. It's very interesting to think about, because if he doesn't give a star, then... Hmm. I mean, look, okay, look. If you guys ever get struck by lightning, just DM me on Twitter, right? We can talk about what the probability was, right? If it was raining, perhaps? Lightning doesn't doesn't have to be raining for lightning to strike, does it? Hold on, I'm about to kill DK here. We wait for that barrel, because it was on the way down. Save some time here. We can make this! Okay, yeah, we're good. And right here, we get the guarantee. We get hit, and then... Eh, eh. Again, at the very ending there, we purposely get hit so that we can, you know, pretty much guarantee that we can knock the other two barrels out of the way and go. Because otherwise, we would have to kind of jump forward, jump back, and do that a bunch of times. And then if we mess up, then, you know, DK can kind of get, a, get ahead of us. <laughs> He's saying that, like, the chances of living are high. No, okay. Okay. If lightning gets you, right, and kills you, I hate to be morbid, but if it gets you... Okay, it was unlucky, but I mean, if you are aware enough to observe that you got hit by lightning, you just survived the lightning strike, dude! That's pretty cool! You know, that's pretty sick! DM me, dude, I want to know about that! It's terrible, but it's pretty cool, right? Like, it's, you know, it's it's, it's, like one, of, it's one of the things. Like, I wouldn't wish that on anyone, but, like, if it did happen, I'm gonna get tested, dude. Some higher deity is gonna... 
<laughs> be like, oh, you think it's cool, huh? <laughs> think it's cool to get struck by lightning? <laughs> Parry this. <laughs> okay, Yoshi is making his way to the star as we speak. Ooh, a two. I wish it was a three so I can actually show you guys the happening space up there, but I want an item. Because then I only have a 10% chance of just rolling a one there. I hope I don't get smited, dude. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, Zeus is just going to come out of nowhere. Five coins? That's not enough. He passes the star. That's really good. I mean, not for him. For us, that's amazing. Look at that, he's one, he's one coin off. Sharp's the word now. I don't know what that means, dude. I don't know what that means. What's really screwing this right now are these. These little coin blocks. Where are they? There's Yeah, there was one down there. There's uh, ba -ba -ba, one right here. And one right here. These, these guys are screwing things over, man. They're making it so easy for Yoshi to gather coins. Because otherwise, I would just kill the CPUs in minigames and they wouldn't have enough coins to get anything. Oh yeah, no. Slow, uh, not slow shroom. Pfft. Super Shroom. <laughs> Zeus, identify this! Dun. Wait till he sees me parry this. <laughs> According to Google, thanks for the donation by the way. According to Google, lightning strikes are a 1 in 15,000 chance. They have roughly 90% survivability rate, which is weirdly high for lightning. Huh. I didn't know. I didn't know it was so high. Lightning has a 90% survivability rate? Dang! I don't... Huh. That's really... It's really strange. Let's see... No tweester strats? What are you... What are you implying with the... The, the tweester strats here? You think... You want me to actually, like, throw down a tweester and hope he gets... I mean, he's already ahead of where the star is. If I throw a tweester down, then... He has a likely chance of getting even closer. I mean, unless he gets shot over here. I like keeping him right behind me. I'm pretty I'm pretty confident with where he is right now, his current placing. 1 in 15,000? Holy crap, dude, that is insane. How's that even happen? How do people determine those odds? What does 1 in 15,000 mean? Does that mean like over the course of your life? What are my odds? Because I don't think that's very specific. I don't know if I like that very much. Because when they say, oh... Mm, Oh, yeah. He did throw down a tweezer, didn't he? Oh, that's not enough. No, it is. We're all good. Okay. <laughs> Feel smoke about downing the fatality of lightning right now. <laughs> Look, it'll be okay. But I don't know how we got in the lightning... <laughs> I don't know how we got in the lightning subject. <clears throat> but what was it? It was about, um... What did the odds mean? 1 in 15,000. Yeah, well, okay. Because when they say 1 in 15,000 odds to be struck... Okay, but what does that mean, though? Like, every second? Every minute? Every day? You have a 1 in 15,000? Or does it mean... 1 in 15,000 people get struck by lightning? Or does it mean, if you're caught in the middle of a thunderstorm... By the end of the thunderstorm, you have a 1 in 15,000? Is that what that means? You say, per lightning strike. I... Someone named Nature, your odds of being struck by lightning are zero, but yeah. <laughs> Close to zero, but never zero. Per lightning ground strikes. It's roughly 1 in 15,300 chance we would be struck by lightning once in your lifetime. Okay, I don't know if I really... Thank you for the donation. I appreciate it. Okay, but some of you are saying that the odds are 1 in 15,000 for your life, or 1 in 15,000 people get struck by lightning during, like, you know, every lightning strike. Those odds are different, though. Like, one of you guys have to be wrong, right? Like, like isn't that... Oh, wait. Here, here it comes. Here comes the tweezer. Check this out. No! No! Why did I end up over here? Mike. Yo, guys. It's our first Mike. <laughs> it's our first Mike minigame. Thank you, Marby, for the donation. You can double your coins. Oh, man, guys. I can double my coins. Holy crap. <clears throat> All right, so... Am I able to pause during this? I don't know if I can. Okay, here's here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna trust you guys. Alright, so... This is gonna start. I'm not gonna look. Alright? 
I'm not gonna look. I'm gonna turn the mic away here. I'm gonna turn the mic away here. I'm not gonna look at what the cards are. I'm gonna trust chat. I'm gonna trust chat on this. Okay? Alright, I'm looking away. I pro- look, you're just gonna have to trust me on this. Oh wait, hold on. Oh wait, I think it's asking for my prompt. Oh, hold on. Okay, okay, it says yes. Okay, now, now when I say yes, I'm not gonna look. Yes. Okay, I'm not looking. Okay. Alright, okay. Alright, okay. Okay, we got, we got this one. Uh. Oh crap, I can't pause. Eh. Okay, there, I pause right there. <laughs> I, I got my, got my, my in, I got my in-game pause. I need to be ready for that next time. I see a lot of grapes. Grape. Oh no. <laughs> Oh, you guys were right, though. Okay, next time I'll be ready. I didn't know you couldn't pause. <laughs> oh, no, guys. I lost four coins. I lost four coins. <laughs> we'll be fine. We'll be okay. I saw a donation during that. What was it? What was the best Mario Party story mode? I think it's three. I think threes are a lot of fun. Because three had all the characters talking to you and stuff, too. Next time we land on that, we're going to do the same thing. But I know you can't pause now, so we're going to have to work our way through. Oh, Yoshi. He's right there. How many coins does he have? He has 29. Oh. This is actually... Oh, this is very not okay. This is not okay at all. If the star spawns in the worst location again, he's gonna get it. <laughs> Mike, mini games are... They are basically guaranteed. That's why I wanted to make it harder, okay? <laughs> it's just I, I forgot to account for the delay. <laughs> It'll be okay. Neck and neck, I want to be neck and neck. Put it in an actual heart to- There you go! Jeez! Finally, gosh, a good spot. I don't even need a good spot. I just need, like, a not terrible one. He got a freaking super shroom. He landed on this! Don't tell me you can get a star from this. Earn some coins, right? What shows up? There's no star here, right? Oh, it's different! Holy crap. I didn't know that. <clears throat> Ooh. I think it was the far left one. No? I think Yoshi and I got mixed up in the same way. I wasn't looking as close as I should have. Was it the bottom left one? Did I mix up the last swap? It's the last two swaps, you gotta be... Jeez. Oh! Okay, so it was the bottom left one. So I mixed up the last swap then in that case. Okay. He's down a star! <laughs> that's crazy! Man! Man, Yoshi, that's crazy! Uh, anyways. Okay, so... I'm not gonna throw a Piranha Plant Orb down right now. Because Yoshi's current coin amount is 9, and that's not really... I'm not gonna get much value from that if he rolls in the next two. I'm gonna try... I'm gonna throw that away. Ooh, right in front of the block here sounds like a good one. Yeah, because he'll get some coins and then he can start losing some stuff. Holy crap, landing on that is brutal. You know, my, my plan was to land on it at first, and now I'm like, okay. I don't really want it anymore. No, just five. Just five, 75% chance of losing a star. Hey, hold on a second. Come on, man. Have you not seen the video? It's not luck. You, you gotta do it yourself. You gotta do the skill. He might get this. Oh, he might get this. He just needs a mediocre roll. He just needs a mediocre roll. That's all Yoshi needs right now. Oh! Oh, beefy! Oh, not so beefy! Oh, that's nice and medium well! Oh, just how I like my... I don't know if I... I don't know. I don't like my stick like that. I like my burgers done medium. That, that, that's about what that roll was. Oh! Oh my gosh, Yoshi! Holy crap! That was a thick roll? He would have won! He would have won! Oh my gosh. Dude, we're gonna be here forever. Crap! He, he keeps getting coins from those stupid coin blocks! See, a lot of Mario Party and what bounces it out is the minigames as well. And the other players, too! But it's just Yoshi here! And then I duel him and it just gets done! I can't take a star? These happenings don't give me any stars at all? He's about to land. Oh, he's about to land. A Hold on a second. I gotta make sure. Oh, wait, no. I really hope it plays it. I hope by default it, it shows you the CPU minigames. I'm pretty sure it does. Let's see. 
<laughs> Let's see, Yoshi. Your first Bowser minigame. Let's see if you can handle it. Let's see if you can handle it. You get another star is going to be taken from Yoshi, dude. He's going to be trying his best. He's the protagonist. I feel like the villain right now, I'm going to be honest. Treasure Dome. Ooh. Let's see if the CPUs have good pathing. That's something about identifying luck I never really looked into as much. Unless it was obvious, right? Or, you know, you clearly have to, like, face off against their AI. Like, a CPU single-player Bowser minigame, that's not something I look into. So I'm curious to see how the CPU reacts in this way. If they take the best pathing. Okay, so he goes forward. Goes right around. Okay. Okay, yeah. Uh, no, that's not good. He, he went in. Yeah, no, he doesn't. He doesn't have it programmed. Because he went in, and then he went all the way back around. He skipped that chest! He's treating it like it's a... What are you doing, Yoshi? I mean, keep doing what you're doing, but... Oh, Yoshi, you are so stupid, dude. What was that? Oh, man. I really am the villain. I just realized I may not be as good of a person as I thought if I'm wishing for Yoshi's demise. <laughs> right beneath Bowser's feet. That's where Yoshi could have been. <laughs> just right there, dude. I don't get it. I wish he got a harder one, though. Like, if he got the one with the, the Mecha Koopas, like, that one, I can see the CPUs kind of just try and do it one by one and not really getting much progress on. I, I, if it wasn't obvious, I'm trying to, I'm trying to, like, cope a little bit with the fact that Yoshi might win a second time here. Because he's at 11, I'm at 10. He has some red orbs that I really don't want to be caught before right now. Ah, oh, if he tweesters me. I just need to get ahead of him, man. I just need to get ahead of him. Some coins? Can I get some coins when using an orb, man? Come on. Four. Come on, let's get a Yoshi roll. Four, five, six. Oh, four, five, six. Holy crap. The wacky digits on the back of my credit card. Not actually. <laughs> fireball orb. Oh, we are in a perfect situation to use the fireball orb. Very rare, by the way. <laughs> no. See, if Yoshi was smart, he might have thrown a Tweester down one direction and then gone the same direction that he threw the Tweester down so that I couldn't follow him with the Fireball Orb. Eight. Ooh, I don't... Gosh darn it. I don't know if I can catch him in time. I really don't like this. If I use the Fireball Orb... He got a freaking Wiggler! How much did he, how much did he pay for that? Okay, as long as he doesn't roll high in this coin block, we're fine. These coin blocks have been... Oh my gosh! How does he keep getting these? I keep getting... I can't do anything about this! Okay, hold on. <clears throat> oh, using a fireball... Okay, if I use the fireball orb here, I throw. Because if I if I use it right now, as you guys know, I can't use any mushrooms, and that's the only way I can catch up. I throw if I use it. Nice, 10. Pull. Okay, so my best odds of winning right now is eating the spiny for 10 coins, so I'll be at... I'll be at 10. And since I go by first place probability, there is a very high chance that it's going to substitute a mushroom in the item shop. So that's a one, two, three, four, five. I'll get some coins here. Six, seven, eight, nine. And I can say no to the gondola unless it forces me. Oh. Oh. I just realized what I did. I just realized what I did. Close enough to fireball him, be honest. I got a nine, right? <clears throat> Was I even close enough to fireball him? I don't think I was. Like... Was I... Oh, <laughs> uh, I don't want to try hard against the CPU! My pride is at stake, you guys! I don't want to try hard against the CPU! Uh, a dolphin bar from Mario Party 8? No, I have. Yeah, yeah, I have. <laughs> Guys, okay, okay. <laughs> Whatever, man. <clears throat> Look, I'm not... <clears throat> Jesus. Yoshi getting stuff in my throat now. Good lord. Alright, no, no, no. No, no, no. We gotta change it again. <laughs> We're gonna be stuck here. <laughs> Alright. 
Guys, we gotta change it again. <laughs> yes. This is a very good stream so far on what not to do. <laughs> oh my lord. No, you're right. I need to drink some water. Mm. There's your ASMR. I'm sorry, Stinky. Wait, is that enough characters? Let's see. I am space S O R R Y space S T I N K. All right, I'm gonna be a good boy. Rue! <laughs> Rue, you stinky! I'm going toxic. I'm going toxic! I'm going mega toxic, hold on. Yes! Screw you, stinky! W! Yes, it's the opposite of nice. We're entering the toxic arc. <laughs> no, I am. I am content. I am content. I'm going to kill this Yoshi. No, I don't want to. That. Let me face Yoshi. <laughs> I want to see him. No, get out of your peach, Luigi. <clears throat> Boo. Yoshi. What would evil Zoom Zyke be called? I mean, I guess you could say Zyke Zoom. That's what most creators do when they make like an opposite version of themselves, right? Waluigi, no, I want to fight Yoshi. Did Yoshi just take his dub and leave? Yoshi, please. Yoshi, I'm sorry. Yoshi, come on. Ghost jump scare, yeah. Yoshi. Yoshi. Yoshi, please. Is it because I'm saying screw you, Stinky? Am I... Is it too mean? Is it too mean? Do I have to reset it? Is it only cycling between just the... Hold on, I think it's cycling. Hold on, let me... Let me go back real quick. It looks like it's cycling between the same characters. Play with Zoom Zyke. Okay, Toad. Yoshi! Yes! Yes! I'm going to kill him. Yoshi, I've been taking the normal strats. Now you're making me... Pay attention to 2% of the game. I mean, there was still like a 10% chance of me actually winning if I rolled, or a 20% chance of getting the actual fireball orb play. But it still would have been a better play overall. It's time to kill you. And this time, hopefully I don't land on Bowser the first turn. And I'm going first. It's time, dude. I think the, I think the difficulty of the CPU is like normal. I don't think it's on Brutal or anything. It's just... The difficulty of the CPU doesn't seem to really matter on the boards themselves. Oh, okay, we're over here. That should be fun. No, but yeah, the, the difficulty of the CPUs doesn't really seem to matter on the boards. I, I'm not really convinced it does. It says, the gates in Waluigi Island are terrible because Luigi's favorite item in Mario Party 3 is a skeleton key. Waluigi screwed over Luigi. Oh yeah, of course. Uh, in a game like this, I don't know if they have any preference for anything. And I'm landing on Bowser. <laughs> what does he have against me? What's the purpose here? This is, guys... I, this happened the second time in a row! I just keep landing on Bowser! This is the next one! Well, last time! This happened too! I mean, I'm not losing the Bowser minigames, but it's just such a waste of time! Dude! He loves me, he loves seeing me. He's like, this time! Oh, this time I rigged the Slaughter World! <laughs> this time! He won't get me this time. <laughs> this time it's rigged! Let me try and time it. No, I'm not. No, no, I'm not going to throw anymore. I want to win this and move on. I want to win this and move on. No more games. No more fun. Identifying luck, identifying skill. No more luck. No more luck. There we go. There's one right there. One right there. One right there. Okay. We have to try hard this now. <laughs> I'm sick of screwing around, dude. <laughs> I hate Bowser. I hate Yoshi. I hate myself for putting L. Of course, I mean, no one, no one who, who, who has like, who is L, right? Takes a W. It's, that's just not how it works. If your name is L, <laughs> if your name is L or your catchphrase is L, you're not going to take a W. That's just, that's just how it works, guys. I'm sorry. You should, you shouldn't expect anything else. 
That's why Luigi doesn't take any Ws. <laughs> okay, we're at 10. We didn't even get anything from that, man. Nice, too. Oh, he's gonna duel me. Yoshi heard all my bravado. Yoshi's like, ooh. Okay, I see. Okay. Alright, Zoomzeki, you think you're hot stuff? Let's play some, uh... What's a minigame I'd actually be worried about losing? Warp Pipe Dreams, probably. Because Warp Pipe Dreams, if they get the the complete 100% route, then you lose, right? Like, you're screwed. Uh, Hip Hop Drop. This will be a very good test to see what difficulty the CPU is on, because brutal CPUs are amazing at this. They are so good. <laughs> Let's see. I'm on the bottom, why? Okay. Yeah, he sucks. He's not, he's definitely not brutal. There's too much of a delay between his, the swing. What's interesting about this minigame is you kind of have to wait for your pogo stick to reach the bottom, or whatever. I'm not going to get anything about this. Or, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm not going to get anything from this. I don't know why I'm kidding myself. I won that duel, and there was a part of me thinking to myself, Oh man, what am I going to get? Oh boy! I can't see! I can't wait to see what I- Oh man! Yo! God, oh my god! Oh my god! god. I can't believe I deluded myself into thinking I was actually going to get something from that. <laughs> Yoshi really landed in that dual space just to try and humble me. And it was just a waste of time. It was just a- Oh, having this tweester is amazing. Whatever. I don't even know. I get nothing from the dud. Absolutely nothing. That's just awesome, dude. What do I have on the 8 here? I have an 8... Five, six, seven, eight. Oh, that's cool. I just land on Bowser again. I'm going to purchase something and then land on Bowser. Okay, so those are probably mushrooms. Yep, they are. Uh, yeah, using mushrooms here is always good. <laughs> Zoom's like identifies luck because he has none. That's why the series started. That's why it started. Some people don't realize is that the main reason, for those of you, the, the lore... The reason why identifying luck started was because I was bad at the game. <laughs> I was bad at Mario Party and I kept losing to what I thought and what I was told by other people was a bunch of luck. Because every time I played, I would get bad luck and I was so upset at my luck in video games that I'm like, you know what? Maybe this isn't luck. Maybe, maybe there's something here I don't know, right? So I decided to look it up, I decided to research, I did a lot of testing, and I found out, wow, there's a lot of things in this game, like in Mario Party 1, 2, and 3, that aren't really luck-based. I think that's cool. So I've been working through the video since it's a long video, and I got a lot, uh, a lot of love, and figure identified luck is one of the best series on YouTube! I think so, too. <laughs> found depth to go into things. These are more and more in the world, Mr. Zack. I, I appreciate that, Shadow Dragon X. And now Yoshi's about to do a freaking Mike mini game. That's the reason why! That's the reason why, dude! Like, I was terrible at it! And then I finally identified it, and I was good! He's only betting 9. 18? Okay, let's see if the CPU is good at this. Let's see. Ooh. Okay, so we got 5 cards, right? Is it 5 for each? Because I know sometimes it's 3, I don't know how it works. Hold the mic, please. Whoa, Yoshi, you did that fast! Why'd you only get 4? We got five! Banana grape, strawberry apple. Yoshi, I don't hear you. Yoshi. Yoshi, speak. Hey. Hey, hey, speak, speak into the mic. Oh, you're stupid. Yoshi! Fruit's your thing! Fruit's your thing, Yoshi! You collect fruit in your game! And Yoshi's story! You collect fruit! How do you not know? You think it's based on the percentage of money you're losing? Ooh. You can get three, four, or five depending on the pr on place. It's probably placing... Yeah, probably. It's probably something like that. Where is... Okay, Yoshi's right over there. He has an egg orb and a yellow orb. I'm gonna try mushroom to get over there. 
We're gonna try this. Unfortunately, Yoshi can't read. What does reading have to do with that minigame? I understand the joke. There was no reading there, homie. There was nothing there. There was no reading. Toadsworth just said, hey, remember these. And then Yoshi's like, ah. <laughs> 9, 10, 11. I can tell. And if for those of you saying, oh, you know, he doesn't understand English, he got some of them right. Am I still bad at Mario Party? Gosh, I hope not. <laughs> I ho I'm only getting five points from these dudes. This is so frustrating. I like to think I'm not. I am when I'm screwing around. When I'm screwing around, it could be like that. We got another mushroom, dude. Screw this. I'm sick of Yoshi getting ahead of me. His rolls are too good. Apparently the CPUs never use the Agorb. Why? Well, don't know. I saw that. There, there was a comment on the latest video that talked about how the the CPUs just will not really use their, their orbs. Or at least the Agorb. Like, they're almost programmed not to. Press the L button. I don't think we have the taunt unlocked. Finally! He only got five coins from that. I've been waiting for it. I don't think it's gonna matter here. What's he purchasing? Is he gonna purchase an orb? No, no, no. That was a big fish. Interesting. Okay, so what you guys are gonna find interesting, that was the 15 coin amount for Pink Boo. Now, for those of you that know, 15 coins is the price for third and fourth place, right? Whereas... I was getting the prize for first place. So in this case, I'm treated as first place and he's likely treated as fourth. He's not treated as second. That's an interesting little bit of the code. Okay, so... I don't really want to use the Maya... Maya Yahi? I'll use the mushroom. I'll use the mushroom. I'll use the mushroom. <laughs> That's fine. I was considering not to and throwing the Tweezer right in front of me, but in the non-zero chance that he does use the Agorb for whatever reason, I don't want to be made fun of. Because I saw in a comment and then someone here in the live chat was just saying, hey, Yoshi never uses the Agorb. And, and I believe that, but I have a feeling if I throw it down right in front of him, he's just going to suck it up and we're going to have a moment here. <laughs> we're going to have a moment. I'm going to throw it right in front and he's going to be like, one in a thousand chance he's going to use that Agorb. And I'm going to get made fun of. And I'm just going to get ratioed again, so. <laughs> Please. Oh. Oh my gosh, thank you. Thank you. He can't afford the star anyways, yeah. But if I got, like, a low roll, for example, right? If I got a low roll, he lands on something else. Yo, single player DK. I want to do a bridge too short. I, I want to show you guys a bridge too short. Because that one's pretty fun to do. A bridge too short is very interesting in that it's extremely easy if you use pause strats. Come on, 20, 30? Yes! Yeah, good luck! Good RNG! We love it! I wish there was a way to alter that. Unfortunately, there is not. There's no way to alter it. Not Jumpman again. Give me a bridge. No, Vine Country! Okay, you guys are about to hear my mashing. This one is a button masher, don't get it wrong. A lot of people look at this one and they don't consider it a button masher because they look at how slow the animations are. Like, look at how slow they're going. You would never think that you would have to press the A a lot in order to do it, right? But just treat it as a button masher, your life will be a lot easier. Okay, here we go. I don't know how difficult DK is. I don't know what... I, DK might be set to the same difficulty. There we go. Just like that. Just that easy. You saw how fast that was? It's a button masher. His difficulty might be static, but holy crap, he just got swamped. <laughs> he got absolutely swamped, dude. I'm pretty sure DK's difficulty is a bit static on the solo DK minigames. Because from what I played, like when you go into the minigame cruise, normally you have to select the difficulty for all the CPUs, right? But in DK, you don't set the difficulty, which leads me to believe he has a very static way of playing. Ooh, Pink Boo. That placement for his Pink Boo was absolutely atrocious. Holy crap. I need to... When it's my turn, I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell you guys why that is like an abysmal placing for his Pink Boo. Try and figure it out before I do. <laughs> like... Like, like, before I explain it, like, like, try and figure out why that placing is absolutely stupid. <laughs> like, 
And it's not just because it's a star space. Like, there, there's more than one reason for it. It's like... Well, because it's right... You know, screw it. I'm just going to say anyways. It's... No, no, no. Never mind. We're, we're going to get on my one. There's like multiple reasons why that's terrible. One of them being that it is a star space. But... Okay, let's see here. Okay. Okay. Good layout so far. Okay, that one up top. Always keep your eyes glued. This is a very good layout. Very good layout. Very nice. That was really fast. Very fast. Wow. <laughs> oh, man. I was really happy about that. I don't know how much faster they could have been. If if the last one was moving clockwise, it would have gone up. Some of them I had to wait for a little bit. I got into a couple of them pretty quickly, though. Ooh, I'm, so, I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I didn't get it done. I didn't get it done. Yeah, I got a super quick cycle on one rotation. It was pretty good. That was awesome. Man. Because... They, they all have, like, their own rotations and stuff, right? But, okay, let me explain. Okay, get ready for this explanation. All right. So, as we know, if a star appears on your orb space, comes back, right? It's a blue space, right? So, if you put... It's not terrible to put an orb on a star space. Because if you're playing a 20-turn game and you immediately throw an orb onto a star space, right? Then you have to wait until the entire star cycle repeats until your orb gets replaced with the star. Now... You still get some value from that, right? If it's in a good spot. Here, the reason why this is so terrible is, one, it's not going to repeat. It's not. It can't, right? And what I mean by that is, there is no reason for me to take this path right here. Zero reason. The only reason why I would is if this star has spawned, correct? But this star, we already got. And since it's never going to repeat, there is absolutely zero reason for me to take the right path. Yoshi should know that, right? So when he places this down here, if I ever arrive at this junction, no reason for me to go right, because the star's already, no star's gonna spawn down here. And even if it did spawn on this path here, it's gonna replace his orb. It's a really, really bad, and it's behind me. It's like, he didn't even wait to like get ahead of me to throw it. And it's in front of a, it is just abysmal. That is just really crappy placement, I gotta be honest. Let's see, uh, where's the star currently? Okay, I'm gonna... What's Yoshi at right now? He's at zero coins. I am going to Tweaster Yoshi. I'm gonna Tweaster Yoshi right now, because if I get him closer to the star, that's actually a good thing. Unless I get him... If I get him in this spot, it's gonna be kind of bad. But otherwise, I can kind of secure my win right now if I Tweaster Yoshi. Because he doesn't have enough coins. He's, he's at zero currently. He's right before Bowser. And hopefully we can grab ourselves an item from the shop right over here. The orb, the amount of space we're moving here doesn't really matter. Is he going to use it? Oh, I thought he was going to. I thought he was going to. Him using the golden shroom, or super shroom, again, another terrible play. He should have waited to use it. Hold on, let's see. Well, we'll see, we'll see. He's at one coin. He's not going to, he's not in a good position for it. He's about to run into a twister. Ugh. Because you don't... The, the problem with using a Super Shroom right before a Tweezer is you don't know where you're going to get thrown to. So you don't know if you're going to want to stall it out or not. You're kind of leaving it up to luck. Look how far back he is. Beautiful Tweezer play. Making me use more than 2% of my power, this guy. Let's throw this right in front of the orb space, just in case. <laughs> I don't hate Yoshi. He's just made a mockery of me. And for that, he must be punished. Stop stalling it, game. Come on. Look, if I can quit out because I know Yoshi's gonna win. Oh, yeah, yeah. Let's get this. If I can quit out because I know Yoshi's gonna win, why can't I see Yoshi quit out? Still thinking of this taking 90 minutes? <laughs> Maybe. No. Probably not. Why are you throwing it behind you? There's no reason for me to go that way. That's okay. I guess he wants some coins from the orb. Honestly, I would have made fun. I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be real with the guys. He could have placed that anywhere, and I would have made fun of him for it. Ooh, now Bowser. 
Oh, man. <laughs> oh, no. I feel so bad for him. Look at his face. Look at his eyes. Half of his coins. That's a solid three coins. That's landing on a... Throshi. <laughs> Who said Throshi? Yeah, Nico. Who said Throshi? <laughs> Throshi. <laughs> what? Throwio. If I say Throwio, you don't know if it's Romario or Wario. Throwio. Okay, wait. Was this the... No, this is the slot machine one. Ah! I'm curious if he's gonna tie, try and time it. Like, uh, like a numb nuts, or if he's gonna actually... Let's see here. Can I pause it? Ooh, miss him up! He's trying to time it. He's trying to time it, Yoshi. Yoshi, just spam it, dude. Yoshi! Yoshi! Oh, I'm kind of rooting for him now. Yoshi, come on! Yoshi! Yoshi, come on! Yeah! Yeah! No, Yoshi, please. Please, come on! Oh, oh yes, you're so good. You're so good, Yoshi! So good at this game. How did Bowser make the key look like that? How does Bowser make a lot of things? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> look, I, I just keep getting my attention brought. Like, look at the logo in the background. It, look, it just faded to black. You saw what I did there? You couldn't even see what it was. <laughs> There's probably two of you that saw that. He's stalling. He's stalling. I, I don't actually care for Yoshi right now. Screw Yoshi. He's stalling right now. He knows he's gonna lose. He landed in the Bowser space. At least I had the audacity to like rage quit when I knew I was gonna lose. Save us some time, you know? Yoshi can't even save us the time. He, he doesn't have the audacity to even save us any time here. Okay, all right. Let's super shroom it up and get out of these canals. I hate Italy. I'm just kidding. I like Italy. Italy's pretty cool. It's the setting of my second favorite JoJo part. <laughs> Let's get some coins here. There we go. Eh, eh, eh. Almost went to the right. Almost through the game. Let's go. We beat Yoshi. Nice and easy. First try. First try. <laughs> it was a pretty bad roll. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, are you keeping track of... Nah, my favorite's part two. I like Joseph a lot. Mario won. We take the W. First try, guys. Who said one, two? CPUs two, me one. Not the Iris fade. <laughs> I can use that in Vegas Pro. I don't use Adobe Premiere, by the way. Does anyone... Look at... <laughs> I forgot we said that. I'm just imagining. I think it's so funny. Because, like, when it showed the... Uh... When it showed the winning messages and, like, the pre-game messages... Like, it was like, let's have fun or whatever. I just imagine Mario going, WWWWW. <laughs> or just, whoa. <laughs> or just, maybe if it was the L, Mario would just go, L. <laughs> the records have been updated, turn seven. Ooh, I wonder what the least amount of turns we can get this on is. Let's see. Yes, we will keep battling. Collect 100 coins and reach the mountaintop. Oh. Screw you, Stinky! <laughs> Screw you, Stinky! Alright. Uh, first person with a Q at the beginning of their username will determine who I go up against. First person with the Q. If you have a Q in your username, this is your lucky day. You choosing one of the worst letters to start your username with. <laughs> I'll give you something out of it. <laughs> Anyone? No cues? No cues in the chat? No cues in the chat. See, look, not a single person here chose Q. That's a, there's a reason for that. Come on, dude. I, look, I know one of you is listening to this like while exercising or something like that. You don't have a Q in your username. No cues. Going once, going twice. All right, guys, it's poll time. Everybody go. Everyone go. Everyone choose. I'm just gonna go based off of majority rules now. <laughs> no cues. That's how rare it is. No one freaking has a Q at the beginning of their username. <laughs> I gave him a chance. Majority rules. Let unleash the gates. Who's saying Yoshi again? Get out of here, you guys. <laughs> Get out of here, you guys. Y'all are crazy. We're not doing freaking Yoshi again. We're not doing Yoshi again. You guys are dumb. You guys are crazy. 
I see a lot of daisies. I see a lot of daisies. Look, guys, I, I think I think it might end up in. I think we're gonna have some Daisyville. And you have some of you are doing the same one twice, and I'm letting you know I can see that. I see you. But regardless, even when I take a take those into account, it does seem like Daisy's the one that we're gonna be going up against here. Ring. <laughs> So me going like, majority rules. Oh look, there's a lot of daisies. And then I choose daisy. Rigged. It's rigged. <laughs> it's rigged, I say. I'm really curious how many dual spaces they're going to replace this time around. This mountain is 4,000 years old. Holy crap, does it stink. <laughs> oh, you thought I was saying that like it has some kind of historical significance? No, this place is, <laughs> it reeks. <laughs> Reach the top of the mountain to win. Wait, just the... But I have to have 100 coins, right? How much does it cost? Ugh! Almost you have 100 coins, Master Koopa will send you back to square one. Oh, we're screwed. Oh, we're screwed. Go second? Let's go. I'm so happy. One of the few times I'm happy I'm going second. There's no slow room on this board. There's not even any stars! <laughs> Stars are no more. What stars? What are stars? I'm terrified. I can't even do star space shenanigans. Okay, hold on. Dude, we're gonna be stuck here. Guys, we're gonna be stuck here. We're screwed. We're screwed. We're done. Because at least with the other one, it's like... We could take different junctions, and with this one, it's just coins. I can't even choose any junctions. Normally, what balances this out is getting good at the mini games and the orb stuff. Oh no! I can see us getting stuck here for a long time, which probably means we're gonna get a first try. So I shouldn't buy anything. Why would I buy a cannon? <laughs> Ooh, a warp pipe would be awesome. Maybe. I uh, no 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 no. I guess a cannon if you end up going past. No. No, there's no reason to. No, I'm not buying it. Why are you throwing it behind you? Guys, look, when you guys started voting for Daisy, I thought we were going to have a challenge. I thought we were going to have a challenge. Why is Daisy throwing the Hammer Brother behind her? I don't understand it. Oh no, not these blocks again. Oh no. I really need a duel. Oh, we're about to start a duel. Holy crap, on the second turn. Is it the same layout? 30 turns? Yes, yeah, 30 turns. AI is ne no, AI is negative IQ. Oh my gosh. Like her skull turns inward. <laughs> but she has double my coins right now. The slaw stupendousness. I think there might be a Oh wait, no, I can't get a star from her anyways. It's still gonna be like a... I actually... Yo, Warpipe Dreams hype! It's time! I get to show Warpipe Dreams and get proven as a fraud if she gets really good luck. Go. I never start in the bottom. I'm not used to this. Okay. Good luck! 50-50? I missed the 50-50. We go back. Let's go! Easy warp pipe dreams. It's just that easy. It's just that easy. <laughs> Man, I remember playing warp pipe dreams, warp pipe dreams so much, and everybody would be like, oh, it's so luck based. It's so this, it's so that. Nah, dude. When I figured that out and I figured out the pattern for this thing, I was so. I'm sick of this. I don't understand. I try so hard. I try to be a good person. I really do. And it just doesn't work. Whatever. That's fine. I'm okay with this. I'm okay with these results. I don't get it. Stop doing the emotes. I didn't even know that you could spam emojis or whatever in the freaking chat. <laughs> oh my lord. Okay. A foe lands in must give up coins equal to the dice roll. But I can't throw it in front of Daisy right now. I can't. Uh. Oh my gosh. This is so stupid. 
This is so stupid. I mean, if I get far ahead of her and use a bomb, but... Oh, man. Whatever. I'm just gonna throw it. I'm gonna throw it right here, man. I don't care. <laughs> I'll throw it right there, dude. No, Warpipe Dreams is awesome. I love it. Because Warpipe Dreams is one of those mini games where, like, you kind of get it first try and you're like, oh, I think I know how this works. Bowser, why? Holy crap. You know what I think? Guys, I think Bowser wants to watch the stream. I think he wants to delay the stream so he can watch more. I think he's got a little bit of a crush, the big brute. Unfortunately, I don't swing that way. Bowser, I'm sorry. I'm sure you'll find a great partner. Huh. Tunnel of... No, it's Slaughter Whirl. It's just more button mashing times. The dual duds are the sole thing that keeps me from playing 7 as often as I play the other Mario parts. Which sadistic design thought that was a great idea? <laughs> well... Bowser. <laughs> Maybe Bowser did. Well, Toadsworth is one that does the slot as... But, like, Bowser, at the very least, tells you up front, Hey, man, you lose this, half coins, all coins, star. You know, Toadsworth is the real villain, because he won't tell you if you get something until the very end. At least Bowser, I know when I'm going to lose, you know? All right, easy key. Okay, that means... Key there, and... Wait, hold on. Eh, eh. Okay, no. Okay, fine, I'll smash it. <laughs> Sometimes we're able to, sometimes you can. You go for one of those moments where you pretend like you're about to time it and then you get it and you're like, yeah, I'm good. I'm good. How would I feel if Bowser sang me the Peaches song? That would, uh... Ooh, don't, don't say that. Uh, that. That'd probably make me reconsider some things. <laughs> you can't do that. If he serenades me, hold on. <laughs> He's already being so nice to me now and not taking any of my coins. If you were Peach in the Mario movie, you would have just married Bowser. <laughs> People were wiling on Twitter with Bowser, dude. I'm not gonna... Look, I'm not gonna be specific, okay? Because th this is this is a family-friendly channel, all right? But those of you know, people were... Pe people were going crazy with Bowser, all right? They were going a little weird. Things got weird. <laughs> Things got weird on Twitter, dude. With uh, Bowser, like, keeping Luigi hostage and stuff. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Zyke, he's like... Let's see. Oh, she's so bad. Oh, she's terrible. Oh, she's so bad. You got, like, none of those. Yeah. Five coins? Oh, you're garbage. You are so bad. I mean... Let's see if I'm any better. Oh, my gosh. Does this game know? Does this game know who I am? Ooh, Sap Orb. And we're, like, within... Oh, this is an amazing find. Holy crap. I am so happy we got that. That was like around like a 10% chance or something. Yo, that's amazing. We can shred Daisy next turn if she doesn't like go away from us. I can't wait to play another dual minigame just to get completely screwed over. Mad props. Oh, this one's garbage. <laughs> this one's so bad. Hey, look. Whose favorite minigame is Mad Props? Anyone in the chat? Anyone in the chat? Mad props. Let's see it. Let's see mad props. Anyone? No one. Nice single person likes mad props. <laughs> Anyone like mad props? You? You're a freaking liar. <laughs> You're a liar. You lie. <laughs> I see so much, so many liars in the chat. If I said you can only play one Mario Party minigame for the rest of your life, you're telling me you choose mad props. You're a liar. You lie. You kind of do. There's no way it's your favorite. If it's your favorite, I, I guarantee you I can find another one that you like more. Maybe. Maybe. Oh, this one is so dumb. You have to do the turns kind of early to not get caught. There we go. And then you have to... But it's still laggy, too. So even if I turn here, look, I'm still going to hit the freaking rock. Ooh, good avoid. Let's go, Zoomzike. Ooh, let's go, Zoomzike. Let's go. Oh, bad time. Never mind. I wasted so much time there. <laughs> I wasted so much time. A brutal a brutal CPU would still be losing to me, by the way. But if I make another mistake like that, then it would probably... Because in my head, I know how brutal CPUs, like how good they are at this minigame, for example. So I kind of can tell, like, where they would be. They still would have lost, but 
I, uh, I flubbed up there a little bit. All these cheap chiefs. They reuse the same environment for like five mini games. There's like the swimming one where the cheap chiefs are coming at you. There's give me a sign. There's when you're on the bridge itself, right? And cheap chiefs are coming up. There's mad props. I think there might be a fifth one. I'm. <laughs> Okie dokie! Yo, mamma mia! That's a dud! Oh, oh man, this is a great Mario Party, Toadsworth! I'm so glad I got you to, uh, you know, to, to organize it. This cruise is so much fun. <laughs> Mario, I'm sorry. I, I, it's just chance, Mario. I'm so, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's chance. It's chance. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> it's chance. <laughs> Mario just slowly becomes more unhinged over time. <laughs> no, she rolled high. <laughs> Crap. <laughs> no. <laughs> Thank you, Flight Simulation Museum. Eat pant. I don't know what that means, but I appreciate it. Uh, Mario, I'm sorry. <laughs> Do try another dual minigame. You, you, you got this. You can come back. You can... Oh, yeah. No, I'll, I'll come back. I'll come back. Don't worry. <laughs> Meanwhile, DK, my homie here. DK, my homie. Hey. Hey, what's up? What's up? Here. Look, look. Let's just cut the crap. Single player DK minigame. All right. Hey, hey, shut, hey, hey shut up, Toadsworth. All right, here's your bonus. Yeah, you can have 10, 20, or 30 coins. And you have some 20 coins. You win this, you get 20 coins right off the bat. I mean, it'd be kind of mean of me to kind of, you know, have you roll that roulette. Oh, it'd be really stupid if I had, like, a, an X at the roulette. Oh, wouldn't that be funny? Oh, yeah, that'd be really funny, DK. Oh, yeah. I'm losing my mind, dude. <laughs> I would have just want some coins. And now I'm going to throw this one. Okay, okay. I just got to focus. I got to focus. Oh, I think DK beats me. He beats me. DK wins. No, he doesn't. DK's garbage. I'm gonna... Hold on. There we go. <clears throat> okay. The reason why I didn't... Uh, or at the very end there, I didn't go to the other bridge was because... If I did go to the other bridge and it was a failure, right, which it ended up being a failure, we know that because one of them has to be, then I would have had to spend time going all the way back and then DK would have gotten the right one. So if you're not super far ahead of DK, you have to wait for him and then take the path he's about to take in order to guarantee your win. So yeah. I like to think that Mario Party 6 and 7 added the mic to figure out when you're talking smack and apparently deliver karma to anyone too cocky. <laughs> you might be accurate with that. That might, that might exactly be it. You you guys don't think I'm cocky, do you? Right? I'm humble. I haven't been I haven't been talking too much smack. I'm, I'm, I've, I've been good. I've been a good boy. Right? I, I think so, at the very least. Why is she doing that? She's so stupid. Oh my god. She's so dumb. Look at her! She landed on the happening and she got sent back to start. She's so freaking stupid. I'm nice, right? Right. Maybe I'm not a good person. <laughs> Maybe not. Um, I'm gonna hold on to this. I'm. Uh, no, I'm not. No, I'm not. I'm not holding on to this. I'm not holding on to this. I'm gonna throw it. There's already a red space there, so that's already punishing enough. Screw you, Stinky. Hold on. Okay. You can't use screw you, Stinky. We did that together. If anything, everybody here who agreed to put, hey, like, screw you, Stinky is at fault, okay? All right. Dual wheel rigged. Also, I've been watching your channel since 2019. I love your sense of humor and all of your wacky videos. Thank you for doing what you do. Thank you, Flight Simulation. I really appreciate you, man. Really helping out a lot. These donations go straight into my freaking coin bank so that whenever I find an editor to, like, torture and have slave away, at my work, I can pay him one dollar an hour. Yes, <laughs> it'll be good. The money you just gave—that—that's that, about a year's worth of salary for my editor. <laughs> He'll be the happiest editor in the world. <laughs> oh no! All the sad, <laughs> the sad face. <laughs> one dollar. 
Yeah, maybe one dollar is too much. I got to Mr. Krabs it up, dude. Game explain moment. No. <laughs> yeah. Wow, she landed right on top of me. Game explain moment. Oh, no. 365 a year. That sounds like a lot if you don't know what the word year means. <laughs> Expected workload, 10,000 bucks. That was actually a terrible move by her. Holy crap. She should have just bet on me not having enough and gone up the mountain regularly, because now she's going to have to go all the way back again. Man. Glad to hear Mario Party has confirmed any chance for the last two new Super Mario Brothers worlds. Yes, there are. Although it's definitely not on my prior priority right now. I really want to make sure that I got Identifying Luck out. As you can imagine, those were like my number one priorities. I do still plan on doing the Zykedowns as well. But frankly, do not hope for them anytime soon, right? Because I know I was releasing them on a semi-consistent thing. But just don't hope for them anytime soon. Treat them as a surprise when they rear their ugly head. <laughs> Five. Ta -da. I didn't say I wasn't cocky. I, I was. I was asking a question. I was. I was. I was doing a poll, if you will, of everybody here, just to see. No, I mean, look. Okay, look, look, look. look. I would never pay an editor like a dollar a year or anything like that. You know. <laughs> what do we got here? Light speed. All right. Anyone remember how to do this one? Anyone want to cook cookie in the chat for anyone who remembers the strat for this one? You guys know it. You guys already know the answer. Let's see if I can get all of them. I'm gonna see if I can get all of them. Okay, I, I, I got, in order to get all of them, I need to kind of start getting these two. Okay, there we go. Okay, I'm gonna grab these right here. All right, let's see, let's see. The only way I can get all of them is if, she, okay, I'm gonna miss one. I'm gonna be off by one. Because if she keeps going on the teleporter, I'm not gonna be able to do everything. Oh, I couldn't. She she went in the teleporter at a strange time. I mean, that is a lot. <laughs> yeah, you follow the opponent. Is there any counter against the, the tailing tactic? Yeah, you do it yourself. I'm serious. Like, the only counter to it is if, like, you stay still and, like, throw them away or, like, uh, like stop for a moment. Because what you can do is you can, like, run back into them and then, like, try and go in a circle around them. A skilled player, like, if someone is skilled enough to know to do the tailing tactic, they're going to be skilled enough to react to you going back and then simply adapt. That's why the best strat is to simply tail one another in a circle. That That's what happens. The moment one of you diverts from that, it's over. Okay, let's check what we've got. We don't have enough coins here. Yeah, no dud that time. I'm really happy about that. Oh. Okay, we have a three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so... Okay. Good example here. You guys ready for this? So you remember how we talked about the reason why to not have the reason why to not have freaking uh any orbs on these spaces here is because people use mushrooms at the top of the mountain. Yeah, we're about to see that in action here. <laughs> the very first time we're about to see that in action here. The next losing message should be dud. Yeah, we don't have enough. I don't think we even have a chance of getting up to 100 coins in time. Because if we get a 2, then we get 5 coins, we go up to 88. And I don't think Daisy can activate anything, like a duel or anything. I don't think there's any more duels. We come this far, that's worthy. Oh, we get some coins. 30? Yo! That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool, pretty cool. I'm satisfied with the 30 coins. I think that's sweet. And also, uh, this, this might be a little cheesy. <clears throat> might be... If, if, if you guys are che if you guys don't like cheesy comments or anything like that, you can feel free to mute me, alright? That, that's fine. Maybe I should wait till we're done with Daisy's turn. Just in case. Just in case. But I remember when I started identifying luck, and in order to get it off the ground, I had to like... You can find it, actually. Like, if you search for it, because there, there's like the Super Mario boards, like, form. And I posted identifying luck there. It got like one response. I was like, hey guys, you know, I don't know if this is where I should post this or not. Uh, hopefully it's okay. Um, I'm doing, I'm making this series on YouTube called Identifying Luck where I talk about chance events and this and this and that. Hope you enjoy. I got like one reply. <laughs> one reply of someone saying, that'd be pretty difficult. It was. <laughs> it was. Whoever replied, if, if you were the one, if you ever see this clip, it was very difficult, right? Because this is years later now. But I remember doing that. And 
there weren't that many people watching but now i look and we have like over 600 people watching dude like that is crazy that is like half of my freaking high school because i remember like in high school i wasn't like popular at all or whatever i was kind of a dork right like i was the dude i mean i guess i was like kind of cool when i wore my naruto cosplay on halloween i dressed as mario in my freshman year um, Mario in my sophomore year, a banana in my junior, and Naruto in my senior, right? I guess that was cool, you know, de depending on which person you were. Like, if you're in high school and you're kind of one of those kids who doesn't really, um... If you're one of those kids who thinks it's kind of cringe to do that stuff, right? And you're like, ah, it's lame that he's doing that. Yeah, nowadays though, people consider that cool. Yeah, banana. Yeah, just a banana, like the banana You guys have seen the banana suit, right? You guys have definitely seen the banana suit. Oh, let me make sure DK's not doing anything cringe here. You guys have definitely seen- just look up banana costume. Or whatever. You'll definitely find it. Okay, there we go. Easy dub. Again, oh! Here, we have to go back. But as you see right there with DK, he takes a little bit longer. Hey, thank you for the donation again, dude. I really appreciate Flight Simulation. You're awesome. Oh. But yeah, like, I wore the Mario outfits and stuff. You know, no one- really really talk to me as much i did have friends and stuff but we kind of grew apart you know as friends do i ended up reading a lot of books our interests weren't really the same they kind of liked going over to a lot of people's houses a lot of the time going to parties not like big parties but like you know like just house parties with people i didn't know stuff happened so i ended up kind of going online instead i never would have imagined right that i'd be sitting here playing mario party and watching 600 people watch Daisy get absolutely shredded again. She got denied two times. <laughs> she got denied twice. Both times. Dude, the first time. The first time she landed on this and got sent back. You know, no, what's so funny about that, if you're new, is that she got sent back here. She took the rocket, saved so much time, landed right here, went up again, and then landed on the stupid happening a second time. She's so terrible. <laughs> Oh, she's so bad. Let's use the cannon. Let's use the cannon. Let's go, dude. Oh my lord, that was so funny. What I'm basically trying to say is I appreciate you guys a lot, alright? Like, I, I have a very old channel, like True Mario 8989 where it was like, where I recorded videos. You can still see them, the videos are there. Or when I was like 12 and 13. Right, making these Super Mario Sunshine videos. That was like over 10 years ago. My voice was extremely high pitched, right? And I only got like 80 views on those things. I was doing it for like years. Like when I was 12 and 13. I was just making these stupid Sunshine videos with webcam recording. It was pretty wholesome looking back on it. But I just, I really wanted people to like see what I had to say. I really wanted to kind of have that, that community and stuff. It's really cool kind of having that now. I think it's awesome. Oh, yeah, high pitch zoom is like, yeah. And, uh, this was like a 25% chance of, unless I'm mistaken. It's like one of those. No, I think it's pretty cool. Thanks for the donation again, dude. Marby. Marby Arby. Oh. I think we're good. As long as I don't. <laughs> as long as I don't get carbon. As long as I don't get carved. Man. Okay. Use the maelstrom? Yeah, you're right. You're right. It's time. Ooh. Ooh, yeah. It would be really cool if when the metal when the, the dragon like swallows the metal character. That, like, it can't spit it out because the metal character is too heavy or something. As proof of your achievement, take the Master Koopa t-shirt. I don't care about your mask. I just got one! I just got one! <laughs> He's like, no, this is my one. This is my Koopa t-shirt. Hold on. Okay, hold on a second. I'm starting to think that th this guy's training and stuff is a little strange. Don't, don't you guys think it's a little weird? Like, what kind of master or whatever has you go up this mountain and only says that you're done and have completed your training after you give him 100 coins? Can you imagine that you go to a karate teacher, taekwondo, maybe you do some, like, cool nature training, and they're like, okay, for this one, you have to climb the mountain, here's your water, I'm gonna take care of you. 
<laughs> you can, you only finish, not when you climb it. You have to climb it with a hundred bucks, all right? <laughs> Just look around the mountain, find some money for me. You can only finish when you have a hundred bucks. Okay, go. <laughs> this is a scam artist. He's telling me, he's like, he's like, you have the wisdom. And I'm like, I don't know if I do have the wisdom. I just gave away a hundred coins to this dude that screwed me over. Identifying luck in the stock market. <laughs> the stock market? I thought you were asking about Animal Crossing, like the stock market, which I think is hilarious, by the way. W! <laughs> w, 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 I like how it scrolls as if there's more to say. W, W, W. Look, we need a new one. How many turns? How many turns? I like how it shifts through the hundreds as if that's a possible turn it can get up to. W! 612? Wow, we got a lot for that. Is that enough to release him? Guys, 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 guys. I think we can release him. We can release him, guys. You know who I'm talking about, right? You guys know who I'm talking about, right? You know what I'm talking about? Check this out. Check this out. You guys ready? You guys ready? Holy crap. Oh my god. Oh my freaking god. Oh my god. I'm so freaking happy, dude. Oh my god. We unlocked annoy mode, everybody. Yo, we released him. Yes. Holy crap. We can finally stinky people. Well, maybe it's not stinky, but it's. Oh, I've been waiting for that. We did it. Finally. I'm so happy. We can finally annoy people. I can't believe that there's like the developers. It feels like something I would do where one of the things you can purchase is annoy mode. Imagine them at the round table and they're like, okay, all right. So we need, you know, we have this currency called mileage points and everything. We need to figure out, right? We need to figure out who, or I'm sorry. We need to figure out what they can purchase. And one of them's like annoy mode, right? You remember how Mario said, hey, stinky, purchase it, right? You have to make it so they can purchase it now. <laughs> That's great. All right. Okay. We're gonna we're gonna decide again, you guys. We're gonna decide again, okay? Uh, but this time, nah, nah. You no, know it's screw it. We're gonna do a poll again. Go ahead, go ahead. Everyone, just spam the chat. We're gonna do it again. We're gonna do it again. Everyone, you could just you guys think boo time. A lot of you are saying boo. You know what? Okay, you know what? Screw your poll. Screw you guys. Stop spamming. All right, <laughs> we're gonna do boo. Boo at Pyramid Park just makes sense. Boo at Pyramid Park just makes sense. Don't complain. Don't complain. All right. Stop scaring. Oh, Jesus, you guys are scaring me. Stop it. Stop saying that. You guys are going to scare people. People are going to join the chat, and then they're going to see all the boos in the chat, and then you guys are going to freak them out. You guys are scared. Oh. Jump scare. I'm sorry, guys. Screw you, Stinky. Wait, hold on a second. Hold on. I have to change something. <laughs> okay, okay. We'll change the... Oh, wait. No, no, no. Why did they switch it? No! They... <clears throat> I hate menu navigation. Menu navigation makes me angry. Okay, we'll change the message. Screw you, Stinky. Screw you. Okay, guys, guys, guys. Okay, okay. Instead of screw you, Stinky. Screw you. Stinky? It's a question. It's philosophical. Philosophical. Boo... Boo? Boo-hoo! <laughs> Boo-hoo! Sea stick. <laughs> no, I don't want to change it. That's perfect. Thank you, Tozworth. Now we have to make sure we get Boo again. Come on, Boo. Waluigi, get out of here, man. Waluigi, leave. No one wants to see you. Let's go. Screw you, Stinky. <laughs> I like how it has to pan. I love the pan on it. Look at it. You can't even, like, look, you see half the question mark. Screw you, Stinky. <laughs> oh, wait, I was on boo. Now I have to go back and forth again. Like, why is he questioning it? No, I know why he's questioning it. Because boo's a ghost. It, it makes sense. Boo's a ghost. You can't smell a ghost. That's why he's saying it with a question mark. I didn't even know. Yo, we found a roundabout reason for why it makes sense. I'm so proud of us. Of course he can't be stinky. He's a ghost. No, you definitely can. Oh. <laughs> Does ectoplasm stink? Maybe. 
Here's the plan. Take the Stolen Star back to the Bowser Sphinx. Oh, okay. Oh, the bandit's here. Nice treasure. It's mine now, fool. Oh, okay. There was a star in there. Interesting. <laughs> now it's time to make like a bakery truck and haul buns. What? Whoa! Yo, that jump was insane. By my fluffy white mustache. Bandit stole the star. Here's a chain job to get that. I'm very interested. I, I thought they would use the Koopa Kid. Because the Koopa Kid already has an event where Koopa Kid can steal a star, right? I thought they were going to use that pro programming. They probably still are. Oh, jeez. Bandit's always on the move. Oh, wow. They, they actually put some effort into this. I'm impressed. And... Oh, boo, why? Actually, this isn't that bad. Well, maybe it is. Because... We're not stealing stars from Boo, we're stealing it from Bandit. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know how this is going to work out. I guess we're going to have to see. Because the coins don't seem to matter as much anyways. This might end really fast. Get the star back and take it to the Bowser Sphinx. This, I can see this ending in a few turns. Easily, I can see this ending in a few turns. That doesn't mean it will. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Oh, <laughs> he said no. Okay, the reason why I was scared just now. Is he programmed to say no? Look at this. Okay, if Boo got that and rolled a 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, he would have had a 30% chance of winning in the first turn. That That's how fast that match would have gotten. That's how, that's how fast it would have gone, dude. <laughs> Mr. Moon, fun fact in Mario Party 6, taunts had to be purchased individually for each character, except Toadette. When you purchased her, she comes with it by default. Ooh. Ooh. Well, well, again, the, the match wouldn't have been, like, over instantly, because we do have to return to the Sphinx, but it's still funny. It's still funny. Wait, why are you saying it now? Is he is he in the path? No, yeah, you can't win the first turn, but you, you, I mean getting the star, like, actually achieving the objective. But then Boo probably would have killed me. Oh, yeah, he's right in the fork there. Okay, I see. Okay, cool. So I'm screwed. Oh, God. Look at Bandit. He's so flat. He's flatter than Pancake. He's flatter than Kansas. No offense to anyone that lives in Kansas, but he's flatter than Kansas. I got careless and lost my booty. Yeah, make a break for it. We didn't even get to see him move. Handsomely now. <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> Take the star to Bowser Sphinx handsomely now. Do it handsomely or the Sphinx won't acknowledge you. Uh... 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7... I'm a little concerned... Oh, there's no Womp! There's no Womp, guys! I'm scared! Can I even... 1, 2... Okay, wait, hold on. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6... Okay, 1... How many coins do I have? No. It's not enough. And there's no coin block there. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Okay. And that's a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. I need to roll a... I, I need to roll a 10. I think I have better odds just going to the right and then getting the one down there. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Ooh. And then rolling double. That's probably what I have to do. I'm not going to do this one. I'm going to get coins from this and then roll double dice blocks on the chain chomp on the bottom right. There is a Thwomp, but he's up top. Ooh. Why is the Thwomp not on the Red Chomp path? Very strange. Very weird. That Thwomp's built... I said Thwomp. That Womp's built different, dude. And not in a good way. Does he have a mushroom? Oh, he has a mushroom, too. Oh, Boo might clean this up real fast if he gets a good roll. Oh, no. Okay, okay, okay. Both of those look like sevens. I thought he was about to get some. No, we're fine. I really hoped he would say sure, because then he has a chance. Oh, he got a golden true. My super true. I don't care what it's called. Oh, no. Oh, we got 10 coins from it, too. So he can buy an orb. He can buy another super shroom if the first one fails somehow. Okay, no, he didn't get that. Oh, the spear guy doesn't really matter. Oh, boo, you're crazy. You're cracked. Okay, I just got to hope that... Oh, I really, really need to roll towards the Chain Chomp. A two? No! I'm gonna get sent all the way over here! I'm getting sent to the other! Crap! 
God, I really wanted to wipe this up. I got a red chomp him. Time to reset! How dare you. We got this. No, no, no. We just got a red chomp it. We got a red chomp it. He won't roll it. He won't get it. I couldn't do anything about it. Okay, still not enough. Uh, still not enough. Roll out. Ah! You... Oh, you stupid! Yeah. Oh. Wait a minute. Maybe he won't. Maybe he won't choose the path. No, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. You have to go around. You have to go around. You have to go around the other way. I just forgot. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're fine. We're fine. You have to go around. I just realized that. It's a good thing I didn't exit out. It's a good thing I didn't rage quit. We're good. We're good. We're good, we're fine. We're, we're fine, guys, we're fine. We're, we're fine, right? We're fine, right? He's safe, you lost. Is that really how it works? Then why wouldn't the Bowser Sphinx be right then and there? Is there nothing I can do? I don't have... I don't think there's a... Is there any possible chance I have that... I don't have a Tweester. Is there a Tweester right in front? I know there's Womp Protection, but like... I know Chomps can't go past, yeah. But I'm just trying to think. I can't swap myself in this one. Yeah, I think you're right. Man, if I had a pink boo and he landed on it, I think that would work, but I don't, I don't have it. A duel? I, a duel wouldn't do anything. I don't, I, don't, I don't think so. Yeah, well, let's see. Yeah, I don't think a duel can save either. I'm, I'll, I'll look at the path. I'll look at the path. Even if you can't throw a past Womps, I was wondering if you can, like, reverse the path. Because I haven't... I haven't seen what happens if you throw an orb, and... You probably can. But you never know. Weirder things have happened. <laughs> yeah, there's probably no way out of this. But... It's interesting to see. Let's take a look where he is. Oh, wow. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, let's let's take the red chomp anyways. Who knows? Maybe they changed it for solo. <laughs> I have no clue. Uh Who knows? Who knows? You never know. I'll I'll exit out anyways afterwards. Yeah, this one's over. 9 eh. Nah, this isn't anything. Eh, eh, eh. Nothing. Anything I can do here? How many spaces do I have? Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Darn it! I was hoping there was a Koopa Kid space I could land on. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. My only hope right now is. Once he's past the Womp, there's nothing that can be done. That's that's not true. If you land on a Koopa Kid space, there's a chance that he can switch the players. Remember? If, um... So, my best chance at winning right now is moving towards the Koopa Kid space, hoping I land on it, and hoping he does a swap. That's the best... Those are my best odds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. No, no slow stream here, too. Yeah, Boo has to roll low. I have to land on Koopa Kid, and Koopa Kid has to swap us. That's what needs to happen. All three of those things need to happen. <clears throat> I guess we'll see. The crazier things have happened. I mean, you never know. It's like a one in whatever chance. He rolled low. Yeah, he rolled low. Okay. First thing happened. 
Now I need to land on Koopa Kid. One, two, three. Ah, oh, I got a one. Okay, all right. There we go. That's it. If I if I got a three, there was a chance, right? I just keep in mind, guys. Don't ever in Mario Party. It's not as fruitless as it seems, because a lot of you guys were saying that there was no chance, but the Koopa Kid was right there. There was a timeline where I landed on Koopa Kid and he swapped us, right? Like that was definitely possible, right? You can't, you can't immediately, even though it looks hopeless, you can't immediately give up like that. You can't give up. It's Mario Party, dude. There's always a way. And that way was Koopa Kid right then and there. Could have swapped the positions. There's a reason why it doesn't end it immediately when you go past the Womp. We're going to try it again against the same Boo, though. No. Boo became Peach. I mean, it was a fast round. I can't boohoo him. The amount of cope. Your cope. I'm renaming you to cope. Anytime you leave a comment in live chat, I'll remember your name, Georgie. Your cope in my in my eyes from now on. Forever. You can never change it. <laughs> or duels. I don't think you can get a duel from the from the slot here. I accidentally made him go again. No, please. Yeah, Peach just died and went from Peach to Boo. <laughs> oh no. I don't want to see this again. This poor Sphinx. The Sphinx can't even move. I don't understand how the Sphinx isn't able to move. I, I like to think this Sphinx is the same one that you see in Odyssey. Just a little headcanon. I know it's not. But uh, allow me to believe for a moment. Now hopefully we can wrap this one up quick. Because I got some atrocious rolls beforehand. Boo, I just could not get it all. I landed on that happening and that really screwed me over. And he rolled super high too. Now everybody, let's be a little bit mature about this. Although I do want to say, this was like a 1 in 100 chance of happening. Around there. Around 100. 1 in 100. Nice. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I mean, not nice. He rolled higher than me. I should have had the 9. I should have had the 9, dude. Now I'm not very nice at all. <laughs> the bandit? Oh, it's on the same spot again. Okay. Well, I mean, if it's in the same spot, it should be easy, right? Yeah. I mean, clean and fair, folks. Yeah, that's just the way I like it. Roll low. Yeah, <laughs> loser. Where's my annoy mode? Oh, wait, I couldn't use it. Am I not allowed to use it in solo mode? Guess we're about to find out. Oh, I got the same rolls last time. Okay, guys, annoy mode. Here we go, here we go. Um, it's not working. Oh! <gasps> Darn it, cancel it. Come on, Boo. Roll higher this time. Keep rolling ones. I feel bad now. Okay. Okay, here is good. If we don't get an eight or higher, we'll just go up. And then we can just try again, right? Okay, yep. We're gonna go up, but, I mean, we can't even go up because of how stupidly low that roll was. <laughs> you guys get one Hey Stinky. <laughs> we need, like, a Hey Stinky counter for Mario Party 7 here. Someone here needs to, like, think in their head. Have, like, a spreadsheet, right? And the, once we're at the very last Mario Party 7 stream, we can know how many Hey Stinkies we got. <laughs> They'd have to be here the whole time, though. They would have to never leave. They'd have to never leave, dude. Uh, we could probably... If we go, like, up this way? Yeah, if we go up this way. Oh, there's a one! Uh, I'm still gonna go up. I'm still gonna go up though. We get fit. We get. We get some coins from that. We get some coins from that. I'm on rage quit. We're good. Oh no! Can you imagine if you were able to use the dice roll that you had here? Oh wow! He used a double. Three. That's not enough. That's not enough. He didn't get it. Is he gonna go up? Is he gonna get me? Is he gonna hit me? What happens to me if he get? That was just mean, boo. You didn't even get anything from that. That was mean. Come on. You don't even have enough coins to get the next one. You lost five coins. You're so stupid. All oh, these low rolls are killing me. All right, guys. You want to play the trust game? We're going to play the trust game, okay? I'm betting everything. All right. We're going to play the trust game, everybody. 
Here we go. We got mic time. I'm not gonna, so here's how this is work. Just trust me on this. I'm not looking, all right? I'm not looking. All right, I'm gonna come back. I'm gonna pause the game. And then we will, uh, <laughs> I'm just gonna trust you. I'm gonna trust you guys. All right, here we go. Okay. Yes. Okay. All right. Which one is that one, guys? What, what are we feeling? What are we feeling? Numero five. Banana. I see some bi bananas. You guys are... I see a couple bananas. Ooh. Banana. Okay, okay, okay. You guys are truthful. All right, now number two. See, this is where it gets tricky because there's lag in the thing. Number two, what are we thinking? Apple? I trust you, Leonardo. Apple. Apple. <laughs> he was probably delayed. Now he feels bad. <laughs> That's how it goes. I have to listen to everybody. The people decide whether we win. It was delayed. <laughs> no, no, it probably was delayed. I didn't wait long enough. <laughs> Guys, it's not his fault. <laughs> Look, watch. I'm about to duel Boo for all of his coins. <laughs> that is so funny. Nolan Void. Did you, did you guys hear what he just said? Can you don't believe what he just... Did you guys hear what he just said? He... He just said a duel without stakes isn't worth playing. Did you actually just say that, Toadsworth? A duel without stakes isn't worth playing? What? He said something like that. He said we weren't going to play because I didn't have any coins. And yet he's totally cool with the dud being here. A duel without stakes? What rot? Oh, what BS? Are you serious? He is so full of it. He's the real villain. Oh my gosh. I can't believe he said that. I'm, I'm literally shaking in my boots right now. The absolute audacity. Okay, where... What's a bone orb gonna do? Oh wait, I, well, if I get the star, actually, never mind. <laughs> I was about to make fun of it. Where did the bandit go? Oh, he's up there now. Okay. No point in using this now, especially because it... Sticks with us for two turns, not three. Uh, let's see here. Okay, all right, we're right behind this. I, I like the setup. We have thirty coins. I think this is pretty good. Ooh, is he gonna do it? Oh, he's gonna land on duel again unless he pays for this. Yeah, he paid for it. He needs to get a decently high roll. What does he need? Like a five, maybe? Yeah, mediocre. He needs a hmm, five. Is that good enough? His reasons like these, Toadsworth has gone missing, yeah. No, he needed a 7. Yeah, he needed a decently high, high roll. I was right the first time. Get out of here, boo. I'll show you a roll. I'll show you my Giga Chad roll. Chain <laughs> Chomp. Hey, you need a ride. <laughs> I'm not doing that anymore. I'm not doing that anymore. That's the only time he'll get me to do that. I got a one. Yo. <laughs> I got the, the beta one in the chat 10. And I get to hit Boo on the way there. Nice. For what he did to me. Let's, uh... Where's the bandit? Oh, I didn't see you there. There we go. Now, where should I go? It'd be faster if I went around like this. Eh, screw it. We'll take a Bowser minigame. I'll take a Bowser minigame, dude. I'm cool with that. That's fine. Do you think Chain Chomps get fleas? No. Probably not. They probably rust if they don't move around a lot. Why would fleas like a Chain Chomp? Come on, look at them, man. They're metal. They're metal. No flea would go on a Chain Chomp. No flea would go on me. I'm made of metal. What, Bowser steals my star? No, no. Come on. Do you not have any faith in me? When have I ever let you guys down? 
in a Bowser mini game, I should specify. <laughs> You're about to play a Bowser game all by your sorry s No! Half my coins, oh no. Oh no, my coins. What do we got? Tunnel of Lava. Tunnel of Lava. Uh, it doesn't really matter, honestly. Why am I made of metal? They are all metal. Remember Mario Party 3? They eat cake, which means they have organs. Eh, that's not one to one. What? Just because you eat something doesn't mean you have the organ to eat. I could shove cake into a metal crusher, right? That doesn't mean that it has organs, right? That's a bit of an assumption we're making, aren't we? Let's see here. Eh, eh. I'm doing this very unoptimal, don't look at me. I was going with them, you're supposed to go against them. No, yeah, like, if I were to take a hydraulic press, put some cake in the hydraulic press, and then crush it, right? You know. Maybe. I mean, it's possible it just goes right through them, or it gets, or there, maybe there's something inside of them that just crushes everything, and then it, yeah, hydraulic press hungry. <laughs> I have to show mercy, but you leave me no choice. Okay, I, we should be able to wrap this up. I don't think Boo's gonna really get us here. And then we'll be halfway through. I remember when I thought this would be 90 minutes. <laughs> It's mainly because I looked up story mode on YouTube and I looked at the time signature for how long most of them were and most of them were like an hour and a half two hours So if you're one of those guys who's made one of those kinds of videos, congratulations. You're better at this than I am apparently <laughs> We don't need to use our bone orb right now Because you can't even afford it Yeah, you can't even afford it. We can land on DK Let's go DK Have we not done one of them? I think we've done all of them, right? Yeah, we did the jump man. We already did Bridge Too Short. And then we did Vine Country. I wanna do Bridge Too Short again. <laughs> what do we got? What do we got? 30, please. 30. I would like to be able to yeah, that's really good. Because I'd like to be able to buy an item on the bridge as I go over. Because there is a sh very small chance Boo might roll a one, and then I roll a one here, he rolls a ten. When he gets to freaking, uh, when he gets to Chain Chomp, steals my star, and then everything sucks, right? So, time for me to outpace a literal gorilla now in a climbing competition. I feel like DK's taking it easy on me. DK got left in the dust. He is nowhere to be found. He is nowhere to be found. How did DK even get up here? There's not even any ropes anymore. <laughs> DK's like, this is easy. I'll challenge him to a vine climbing competition. Surely I can best Mario in that. And Mario's like, oh no. I'm going to be getting something from a duel. This is close enough. 30 coins, dude. I should probably use my bone orb. Oh. <laughs> Leonardo. <laughs> I know it was delayed. You're okay, Leonardo. I love you. <laughs> no worry. <laughs> look, look. I, I semi did it on purpose, alright? I, I decided to go for the 50 50. Okay, wait, hold on a second. Wait a minute. Hold on. Leonardo, maybe you are in heart wa hot water. Because remember, the first card was a banana, and the second card was a strawberry, but I mistook you for apple. So does that mean you got the first one wrong then? That's what I'm curious about, because you said apple, and I got that wrong, and that was my fault because of the latency. However, the first answer was banana, so shouldn't it have been banana, right? For Shouldn't I have gotten banana wrong? So either, so you might have just gotten the first one wrong in that case. Maybe that's what happened. Or you saw the wrong one. That's what the other people said? You just said what the other people said! <laughs> I blame the rest of the chat! You guys aren't innocent either! He said freaking Apple because of you guys! I'm, dude, I'm giving the whole class attention. Whole class attention, it's over. You can still hear the music, this didn't work. Okay, there we go, we're back. Boo sucks. Dude, there's someone here. So delayed it was from a previous minigame. There's someone here who said Apple that Leonardo copied. That's the true villain of this. That's the true villain. 
The true villain. Favorite board from each Mario Party. Oh, dude. If I were to go over that, it takes so long. If I were to speedrun it, though. Thanks for donations, by the way. I feel bad that you donated just to clear your name, Leonardo. <laughs> I feel bad for donating. I really appreciate that. I'll, I'll, I'll take care of your money. Where? Okay. Real quick. I could probably speedrun the... Uh... He still can't get me with this. Uh, Mario Party 1, it's Luigi's Engine Room. 2, it's Horror Land. 3, Spiny Desert or Chilly Waters. 4, uh, maybe... I don't know. Any of 4s? Jesus. Uh, what are some freaking Mario Party 4 maps? I'm blanking right now. I've heard... Maybe Shy Guy's Jungle Jam, yeah. Uh, 5, Pirate Dream. 6, Ecad's Garage. 7, I guess we'll find by the end of it. By the end of this, we'll find out. Yeah, four, I just... I don't like the design of four's maps. I mean, design-wise, they... Oh, no, four, it's haunted is the, the booze haunted one. Totally forgot. It, it just totally slipped my memory. I love the booze one. Goomba's Greedy Galley is pretty cool, too. But it's just, I don't like that you're running on metal the whole time. That's my problem with Mario Party 4's board design. If you look at any of Mario Party 4's boards, I'm gonna grab Tweezer just in case. But if you look at any of Mario Party 4's boards, it's all taking place on this very rectangular, angular, metal husk, you know? But if you look at the board design of five, of six, of seven, heck, screw that, go before four. But, yeah, before four. Yeah, one, two, and three, right? They're not on like metal husks or anything. You know, it, it looks a lot prettier. And I can give it some slack because it was their first GameCube Mario Party. But Mario Party 1 was their first N64 Mario Party. So it's like, what's the excuse there? You have to wonder. Where's Boo? He has like 10. Okay, I... Okay, uh, still no reason for me to do anything else. Oh, no, not this. Not this one, man. This one sucks. You can't, again, I... So no one calls me bad, all right? You can call me bad for other things. Not for this one, though. I don't give you permission because you can't collect all the coins in this one. Most likely, you have to get an extremely lucky layout. And even then, it's like... Yeah, look at that layout. Like, you can't swim fast enough to collect some of these. Okay, we got some of these. They're so much faster than you, too. Take a dual space just in case. Oh. If he lands on a one... Okay, okay. I, I was thinking about the ways that Boo, Boo could win right now. If he landed on a one and then got teleported to the other side of the screen, he's about to land on my Piranha Plant. Screw him! Yeah, it's Piranha Plant that grows in desert. These Piranha Plants really are just built different, dude. No, but if he got a uh, happening space and then landed or popped out the left side of the board and then quickly made his way up to the red chomp, then things would be a different story right now. Where is he? I just want to make sure I don't screw this up. Okay, we're still fine. No reason to use my orb. Man, is it taking a long time. Oh, I didn't even get a mushroom there. Ugh. Oh, he's super shrooming it. This is exactly why I'm holding on to my, uh, my bone right now. Because if he manages to roll a really high roll and then work his way all the way around to the red chomp, then he can hit me in time. He definitely can still win this. Oh, crap. Oh, yeah, that's just enough coins for it, too. I am so glad I held on to my... Oh, no. Is he about to buy a mushroom? No, it's a tweester. Okay, this... Little bad. Just a little bad. If he gets a mushroom from this... Oh, he got a super shroom! Holy crap. Yeah, screw you, boo! <laughs> I wasn't worried at all. Look at him. <laughs> Man, what a dork. He actually thought he stood a chance. <laughs> he actually thought he stood a chance. I'm, I'm so close to it. He thought there was any chance. That's kind of crazy. Holy crap. Can you imagine freaking falling into that crap? Couldn't be me. Couldn't be me. Get me out of here. That was a little scary. And now I should probably use my, my bone orb so I can secure myself. Use your super shroom! Boo, come on! God, I hate it when people don't do something optimal. If they're new to- Dude! You landed on my prana plane again! You're really feeding him! Mm, delicious. 
<laughs> Prestige, thank you for the donation. I love how Smash Ultimate took inspiration from the N64 Mario Party boards for World of Light. You run across giant JPEGs in both. I know you probably don't mean it that way, but that sounds like such a backhanded comp or a, a backhanded compliment to like Smash Ultimate, saying that you're basically running on a JPEG. I'm not sure if you intended that or not. <laughs> you're like, you're running across JPEGs in both. I mean, it sounds like it looks pretty in World of Light, but it's just, it's really funny to me. Okay, one, two, three, four, five. That is it. That is it. We are good. I'm pretty happy about that. I'll let you through. You know, you know what I'm curious about? Are the Womps born with the bandages on their back? I'm really curious if that's how it works. My star! My beautiful star! You brought it back to me. Here you go. See, this makes sense. Like, I'm, I'm returning something that was stolen. The Master Koopa was just greedy, okay? <laughs> I don't know how to thank you. So beautiful. You don't know how to thank me? No, I mean, you got some gold over there. I mean, that'd be pretty cool. You'll thank me in Odyssey. Don't worry. They are born with back problems. Yo, just like me, for real. <laughs> I have lower back problems every now and then. Also, eye problems. I had, I had like, three eye surgeries when I was young. Because I had a lazy eye in my right eye. Boo! I forgot the C-stick. Boo-hoo! <laughs> oh, no. Channel's on the line, no. We'll have to do Neon Heights. Oh, lordy. Yo, guys! Guys, we can do it! Guys, we can do it! Hold on! Guys, 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 we can do it! We can freaking do it! We can freaking do it this time! We can do it this time! We didn't get it last time! it last time Christ this will make it a lot more fun holy crap unlocking freaking brutal mode so that these CPUs actually are worth a challenge Christ jeez thank you for the thank you for the donation I appreciate it I appreciate it it zooms like loses next map discord server gets deleted that sounds pretty funny let's do it let's do it you put the discord server on lockdown <laughs> You put the Discord server on lockdown. Yeah, we got annoy mode. Of course we did. Who do you think I am? Free the bones? What? Whose bones? I know dry bones. Okay, wait, guys, 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 guys. First want to say the name of a character. That's what we're doing. That's what we're doing. First want to say the name of a character. First want to say the name of the character. First want to say the name of the character. Let's see. First one of the draw. I still don't see him. Luigi, let's go, Meta. You're so cool. <laughs> let's go. You were on point, bro. <laughs> Dude, even if it was the next person, it still would have been Luigi. Nah, y'all are too slow. Y'all too slow. Y'all could never beat the Meta's quickness, dude. He was on that. He was on that, so his internet speed faster than yours. <laughs> Wait, no. No, I still have Boo-Hoo. Wait, maybe it still works because Luigi's scared of ghosts. It still works. This is really funny. Like, the losing messages, or like when you, the winning messages work, but we don't know why. We have screwed you stinky for Boo. Right, with a question mark, because he's a ghost. And then we have Boo-Hoo, because we're trying to scare Luigi. <laughs> Welcome to Neon Heights. This is the place where dreams are made and broken. <laughs> Ain't no way. No, I guarantee you. It wasn't the latency. I even waited, too. He was faster. The moment everything started spamming, that's when his one came in. You have no excuse. Your internet, it, it, it's just not, it's not built the same. It's just, it's just built different. <laughs> Oh wait, crap, I don't know which... I don't know what I was supposed to do. I don't know what I was supposed to do. It's Apple, you're right. Crap. Dry Bones was technically first, maybe. Yeah, you're kind of right. <laughs> Keep it clean and fair, folks. Yeah, I bet you're the one to say that, Toesworth. Having those duds. Okay, alright. What's the objective? Find three stars in the treasure. Three? What the frick is this? Yes. Why are there so many? <laughs> you expect me to go through all of this? <laughs> I didn't expect to see a board full of the... I couldn't just use this. Does this have all of them? Hold on. I don't think this has all of them. 
Hold on, let me. I'm, I'm double checking. I'm double checking. I'm double checking my thing. Crap, I can't pull it up and. I am checking to see if this has all of the stupid little spaces here. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure it's off by one. I am very confident that it is off by one. All right, let's check. There is. No, this is all of them. Holy crap, this is all of them. I could have just used this. I could have just used this. What is wrong with me? All of them, are you serious? Why did I go through the effort of making my own map on Photoshop? I could have just screenshotted this. Gosh darn it, dude, that was such a waste of time. I spent so much, I spent like two minutes making that map, you guys. That's two minutes I could have gotten back. Okay, I, let's head to the right. Because if they're a bob -omb, then it won't be as bad, right? We'll just get a launch back, but we won't get launched back far at all. Yeah, if graphic design's my passion, yeah, I guess so, man. I can't believe Luigi's about to... Whatever, man. I didn't think he was going to roll that much higher. Now I don't want to be here. It's a ba -bomb. It's a ba -bomb. I'm telling you guys, check this out. You guys ready for this? How do you know? How do you know? <laughs> How do you know? Find out on Identifying Luck, Mario Party 8. Why did I hide the secret in 8? I never know, dude. <laughs> there's just, there's just going to be a random part of Mario Party 8 where I correct something in Mario Party 7. <laughs> you saw the lag? My, my GameCube's a little laggy, okay? It's fine. It, it happens sometimes, alright? Doesn't yours? The matchmaker hap- No, please. No! I haven't practiced this in so freaking long. It's going to embarrass me. I don't want to do this. Oh my gosh. This is about to make a mockery of me. I was hoping it wouldn't have landed on this. That's a joke. I saw red. I saw red. Oh my god, man! I'm so mad that they gave me both of those! The cheap cheap and the paratroopa orb. Like, the, the, the cheap cheap and the freaking paratroopa shell. I hate these things. Because they have the same layout. They're both round. They both have that little tan part on the bottom. Right? And they both have a wing. And they're both the same size. And they were right next to each other on this. If they were at least separated a little bit, I could have differentiated them. Oh my gosh. Unidentified. Identify the skill. Crap! <laughs> I never practiced that one, dude. I never practiced. Did you just put a did you just put a space in between Zoom and Zyke? I can hear that when you say it, you know. Whenever someone says Zoom Zyke, I'm like, why'd you put a space in between? <laughs> I've had people say my name before. They'll be like, oh hey Zoom Zyke, and I'm like, don't say it with a space, please. And they're like, oh okay, sorry, Zoom Zyke. And I'm like, thank you, that's better. I didn't press pause. What the heck? Yo, I'm scared. I d Guys, I swear to God, I didn't press pause there. Did I? How did how did that happen? Did I hit it on my table? Did, did Luigi pause? I mean, I'm able to pause now. I'm scared. <laughs> I'm scared. <laughs> I must have accidentally hit it somehow. Did I press a different button? Is there like a keyboard that pauses my freaking game? I didn't even have my... <laughs> You press pause? Okay, thank you, sir. <laughs> Dude, yo, boost, boost freaking me out, man. Oh no, it was the space. Holy crap. No stars, right? Maybe Toadsworth. My totally real GameCube? Why are you doubting that this is a GameCube? Look how HD everything is. It's my HDified GameCube. Oh, you suck. Dude, I am glad Luigi's ahead because he just keeps getting absolutely destroyed. <laughs> Zoom's like, hey Aiden, I, I notice your messages. <laughs> oh, good guy, that Aiden guy. Oh, the chest. It's only four away. Should we use a mushroom? Probably not. No, no, no. I, th I think it'd be safe to use a mushroom in this scenario. Because we can use a mushroom, we can chain it to a mu another mushroom, we can chain it to a super shroom. Yeah, Zoom's Ike. Okay, I could definitely hear that. It's kind of like how Spider-Man, like, th there's a Spider-Man panel, if any of you are Spider-Man fans, and, like, read the comics, or just seeing the panel where 
someone says Spider-Man. They're like, Spider-Man. And he's like, thank you for including the hyphen. Most people forget that. And I'm like, what? How does he know? What can he tell? Yes, I got a star. Yo, I think this is going to be the best one, you guys. I think it's going to work out. It's going to work out this time. We're going to get it. We're going to got star and get it. Mario stole my star. You lousy Koopa kid. Don't let it take it again. Five more treasure chests. I wonder what the layout of these are. Because again, I haven't studied this. I haven't studied the solo cruise. You need a lead. I got it. Easy. I get all these. I could do this with my eyes closed. I mean, I'm not going... I mean, yeah, I, I'm here. Let me... Ah. Ah, there we go. Oh, now let me take my blindfold off. Oh, oh man. Oh, it looks like I... Oh, wow. looks like I did pretty good. 14 coins. See, you guys? Those blindfolded speedruns. <laughs> we make a mockery of those in this chat. <laughs> In this stream, we made some... Well, oh, look, I, oh, I missed one? That's probably because I had the blindfold on. That's probably because I had the blindfold on, you guys. He's silly, silly. Man. <laughs> I've seen videos of those guys faking those kinds of things, dude. One of these days, I do want to try it. Like, I want to try and memorize the boards as best as possible and have a blindfold on when I do it. Would you guys like to see that? Would that be fun? Because I, uh, I don't have, like, a pretty... I don't have an exact memorization of the boards here, right? Like, down to the space, but if I get caught at a junction, I'll know where I am on the board, right? But I think it'd be a lot of fun for me to kind of do, uh, like a blindfolded one. I think that'd be, I think that'd be pretty sick. Okay, no reason to really... Let's see. Okay, I'm just gonna play it safe, right? Eh. No, this is still fine. This is still fine. It might be possible. No, yeah. No! I said it was fine, and then I landed on Bowser. There is, the only way I really lose to Bowser and lose a star here is if he gives me the roulette and I have absolutely atrocious luck or I get the absolute worst layout on the chess, I will never lose that one Mecha Koopa one. It's just never going to happen. Half my coins? Oh, he's not even trying to take away a star. What a good guy. What a good guy. Yeah, the blindfold challenge, right? Blind Zyke. Yeah, we would need proof. Yeah, of course. I'm just not, I'm not doing it here because... I hope you guys trust me when I look away from the cards and everything, right? But if I were to do an actual, like, blind playthrough or stuff, I can't just say, oh, trust me, I'm doing it blind, because people have cheated before, right? And, like, even if you guys trust me, it doesn't really matter. Like, I would want someone to have the, the blindfold on anyways. So, I would definitely do it, just because it'd be lame, too. Even if I knew everybody trusts me, it's like, I may as well have the blindfold on anyways. It doesn't even matter if I get hit here, honestly. They keep reversing direction. We can get them. Jesus, where... Is it in the last one? Gee, it was in the second to last one I checked. It looks like it was the last one I checked because I destroyed all of them, but... Man. I don't know, dude. Like, that luck was atrocious. <laughs> but, like, you can see there that if you get the worst luck on that minigame, you're still fine. Even if you mess up... I, I got hit a few times and I was still good. But on the roulette, if you get atrocious luck, you're kind of screwed... Or the treasure box, unless your pathing is extremely optimal, even if it is 0.8% chance that you lose that. Which, you know, stuff happens. Alright, Luigi, what do you got for us? He's got the Super Shroom. I, I've i opened up one chest, I believe Luigi's opened up two. Oh, yeah, that's not enough to pass me up. And what I mean, uh, he's gonna pass me up. I mean, like, that's not enough to, like, get so past me that he'll reach a chest before I do. And he already got two bombs out of the way. That probably means that... Well, actually, no. Most of the chests might contain bombs. What if one of them contains a star? Oh, that'd be really scary. You're so bad, Luigi. The L stands for Luigi. My dog can do better. That shy guy is so mean. <laughs> Ooh, he got a 20 from it. It's almost like he did the minigame. That's even better. No? You're not purchasing anything? You're crazy. Oh, no. Oh, no. He got the mic space. How much is he going to bet? Like 10? They never bet at all. I'd like to see him bet at all. Come on, man. Don't be wuss. Seven? You're so lame. Come on, man. Give me something to look forward to, Luigi. Ooh. Ooh, I just thought of something, you guys. Okay, even better? Even better. I go... Okay. 
Okay, okay, okay. Oh, dude, best idea. Tell me someone's done this before. Okay, so you know how there's a solo mode, like one player versus another, you could do a 1v1. Okay, let's say I do it again with a blindfold, but my opponent is you guys controlling the character. So you guys play against me, but I'm blindfolded. So it'd be a blindfold versus chat challenge, right? I think that would be so much fun. Holy crap. That just came into my head. I'm like, wait a minute, because I can make it so... Because I can make it, I could set the second player up, right? And then I can have it so the chat controls that player, right? Just like normal, right? And then I'd be handicapped because I couldn't see. That'd be really cool. And then you guys would, oh my god, that'd be so much fun. I want to do that. I'm going to do that, dude. I want to do that. Oh, that'd be so much fun. Doug Doug did that? Doug Doug moment? So wait, he so he's done like a blindfold versus the chat moment? I've seen him do some, uh, some, like, commands and stuff before. He work in the infrastructure. Yo. Because I've done chat versus chat before, right? And I know, um, Doug Doug has done, like, uh, some other stuff. Has he done a blindfold ver- Yo, no, he's done a vo- Oh, voice command versus chat. He's done voice command versus chat? Good. <laughs> no, yeah, streaming versus chat? No blindfold's been done yet? Yes! I'll be the first! I'll be the first. No one can steal it. <laughs> no, no, Doug Doug's crazy, dude. He's awesome. Like, I I've seen him do, like, the Mario 64 thing. No, that's amazing. But, like, blindfold versus chat? I gotta be the first, dude. I gotta do it. He, is he didn't do a blindfold. Okay, cool, cool, cool. All right. Amethyst says, fun fact, my birthday's next week, and I've been binging all our identified like videos, so I could be a monster to destroy all my friends since we agreed. My birthday is all day Mario Party 1 through 7. Holy crap, you are going to have an absolutely terrible time. I hope you have fun. <laughs> Oh my lord. Are you sure about that? Six, seven, eight, nine. We're gonna roll a ten here on purpose. Thank you so much, Amethyst, and happy birthday. Hope you have a good one. Uh, I'm gonna... Oh my god, the money distracted me. Let's hope that's a boo or a, a bomb. Oh no. My greed. My greed. Let's see if it helped. My freaking greed! Yeah! See, it worked out, worked out, worked out. <laughs> Thank you, Oratachi Nosaka. <laughs> there were four guys in space, and one of them killed the other three with Pogo Gogo. Would that be messed up or what? Not if it's a minigame. If it's a minigame, it's fine. <laughs> My hubris. <laughs> I appreciate you guys. Holy crap, that screwed me up almost. <laughs> My lord. Oh, dude. No, yeah, Van Gogh, dude. If, if you could work on the infrastructure that a little bit, like make it so it's a single chat, right? It should be less complicated than the previous chat versus chat that we did on uh, streams before. Yeah, Doug did do blindfold, but never made a video. Yeah, but he didn't do blindfolded versus chat. Even if he did, I'd still do it, of course. I'm not saying I wouldn't, but it, just, it feels better that I'm the first one to do it, you know? Because everyone's done, like... Like, versus chat, maybe blindfold, voice command versus chat, but blindfold versus chat. I think that'd be really cool. Now, okay, so where, let's head up, because then we can nail the two chests up there. And even if we're wrong, so like, Luigi's in position, look at Luigi's placement. So if Luigi heads right and down, he can only hit, let me, I'll show you guys. Luigi can hit this chest and this chest, and even if they're both stars, he's not at three, right? Which must mean... Unless the chest reset, that the, yeah, that the, he, he can't win. He can't win. That's what I'm kind of trying to say. Luigi essentially can't win right now. It's unwinnable. Unless he, like, I get Bowser or something crazy happens. <laughs> you know? You have to brief me more in depth on how the bot works. No, yeah, absolutely. I'll do that. All the chests are now star chests? Yeah, yeah. That definitely makes sense. Because, like, three and two. Otherwise, things would get a little wonky. Are you trying to fireball me, Luigi? Don't do it. Oh, you absolute tool. You tool. Oh, no. I'm right in front of him. Oh, my gosh. Luigi just got the best layout. Luigi just got the best layout. Well, he just has to roll onto the same space as me. Oh, no. He's about to make me eat my words in the fireball orb. Oh, no. No, he landed on me again! <laughs> Crap! <laughs> no! Stop it! 
either roll super far past me or not. Oh my freaking god, this is just a four. I'm right before the... <laughs> Luigi. No! Again! That's another freaking landed on me! Dude! <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> it's three in a row! Screw you! I'm getting the star and I'm leaving this place. Cook a combo breaker. <laughs> Good lord. How did he pull that off? That was 25 coins. Oh. I'm good. We good. We good. Oh my gosh. <laughs> he obliterated me. I didn't appreciate that at all. Oh my gosh. Well, as a Koopa kid, don't let them take it again. Yeah, yeah. We'll start. <laughs> Wait, I, I need a Hey Stinky. I need a Hey Stinky. Get me away from this monster. I don't have enough for the other one. You were wrong. Oh, you think there's another ba bomb? I don't have enough. I don't have enough. I don't. If I go right, okay, it'd be better to go right because then I can, I can hit this coin block here and then go down here to get it, right? And hope Luigi doesn't get there in time. Also, if I roll a one on my next turn, I can land on Bowser for free coins. <clears throat> oh yeah, the coin cost, yeah. Is the cost going up by five per chest opened? Yeah, I think it is. That would make sense because it started at 10, right? And then it went to 15, 20 for Luigi's first two bombs. And then my first star. I, I think it was something like this. Um, I did not unlist my clan ad video. It got copyright striked. It was taken down. I am sorry. The clan ad video is no more. <laughs> it is uh, unfortunate. They killed it. <laughs> That's why I don't make anime videos as much anymore. If I ever want to make anime videos, like stuff on anime, I'd probably do a second channel because I that video got murdered and I couldn't do anything about it. And I had one strike on my channel for a bit, so it was a little sad. Something high here. No. No. Come on. DK would be great. A one here would be nice. Because then if I get a single player DK minigame and it's a bridge too short, I can easily... Because even if he only gives me 10 coins, that's still fine. Because I can land in a blue space and I'll be good. Go right. Go right. Please go right. Yo! Take the shortcut. Yo! Oh! Come on. Um, is there anything else that could... Uh, he's going to get two. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh no. I don't like what I don't like the position right now. Oh no. It's really expensive. Yeah, I should be throwing down the orbs to ensure I don't land on them. That lag exists on GameCube. Yeah, yeah, see? It exists on the GameCube. Oh. Let's see how good you are at baseball. We need a new slugger. Mario Sluggers. Do you guys want a um, new Mario Sluggers for the Switch? You guys looking forward to that? It's not confirmed or anything. I want to freak you guys out, but... I, honestly, I'm not sure I want one right now. Because I'm just... I've been... Luigi, what are these swings? Holy crap! Dang! That was awful. You guys don't want it? Because it's like... The newest sports games just haven't been very impressive. I want another one that's really good. But, I don't know. I just haven't been really impressed as of lately. Three. Oh, this is really bad. This is so bad. He's gonna get to the one that's to the right of me a little faster. I'm seeing Strikers Battle League. Big nope. Yeah, and the Super Rush wasn't really exciting anyways. Oh, here we go with Luigi. I just miss... The old Mario sports games, man. I feel like the Mario spin-offs have kind of waned in quality. Holy crap, Luigi! He just said, screw you! I'm not betting enough! Why you leave one? What was the point of leaving one coin there? Just bet all of it. Just bet all of it! Dude, Luigi. Dude, Luigi's going big balls here. He's going big balls here, dude. Let's go, Luigi. Come on. Come on. Hold the mic. Watch the cards. He only gets four?! He's ahead of me! Why is he getting four? I got five! Yeah, screw you, Luigi! Lose all of your coins! Let's go! I'm so happy about that. Nice! The L stands for loser. Loser! 
right before the chest too. Could not have been better. Now, if it costs 35 coins, I may not be able to afford it though. That's the problem. Unless I land... Oh wait, no, I can't even hope to land on this duel. No, this sucks. Uh, No, there's a chance. No, there's a chance. If I get this one, that's 10. And if I land on a blue space... Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna throw the toady onto the red space. To So if I land on it, right, then I'll get more coins. Okay, cool. I got coins from that. Nice, that's four from that. Let's see. I uh, hope I get a good roll. Okay, th th that's actually good. That's good. Because Luigi can't afford it anyways. So I stall out a little bit. I get five coins. Alright. Uh, oh, uh, super mushroom. I don't know why they don't just call it a golden mushroom. Oh! Yo oh, darn. I thought he was going to get the... That would have made me cry. I think that's like 50 coins. It's something stupid. 35 coins is the cost. Oh. But I can only get 10 coins from that. No, no. It's, yeah, it's, I guess we'll see. You know, something I really like doing and I didn't find luck. And I, I show the footage during a point where it doesn't really make sense to. But there's a part of it where Mario is currently being zapped by the zap warp. And he's shooting like this. But he has like a little electrical particles around him. I thought that, I thought that looked really cool. So I decided to do that. Yeah, 777 gives 50, but any other triples 30. Yeah, that's right. He would have been down by 4. That's why the 35 coins surprised me. So it is going up by 5, then. <clears throat> Ooh! Yo, it looks like he ended up in that. He ended up there anyways. Okay, 10. What are you getting? Another super. I... That's fair. I, I think Luigi's doing the best he can right now. I think that's fair. Yeah, he's going up. He's going to try and super to get to the chest on the right. And then, like, work his way down. Ooh, a duel! And if he gets coins away from me, holy crap. I kind of want to be in Luigi's position right now to see if I can pull this off. But, like, I don't, because I don't want to repeat this one. <laughs> I want to do one without repeating. Well, we did that with Pagoda Peak, but... Yeah, the winner gets a turn in the slot of stupendousness, of course. Let's see what we got. Warpipe Dreams! Yo- Oh, Royal Rumpus, okay. Alright. This one, very interesting. Gotta make sure you ground pound the Goombas. Jumps do not count. I'm starting in the bottom right again. I do not like that. I'm just gonna get the one closest to me real quick. I'm gonna head to this bunch over here. Okay, golden one's about to show up. Got him. I haven't gotten any doubles. I didn't get any doubles, but that's fine. I got the golden one anyways. The ones I kept going towards the... Because you can't control the Goomba AI. It's not like you can herd them or anything. But the, the Goomba AI, they kind of just go around wherever. It'd be nice if you can herd them into a corner and then smack like three of them at once or whatever. I mean, that'd be pretty sick. But for the most part, yes! Yes! No more duds. I'm so happy, dude. That's so good. So even if I somehow mess up the baseball one, I won't. But even if I somehow mess that up, oh, I'm so glad to have that leverage. No! Stop, dude, please. Please stop, dude. Ugh. I rolled low last turn, and I'm rolling one right there. Come on. Holy crap. And he got a mushroom, too. Luigi, where are you going, dude? You aren't gonna make it. Go right. Okay. Alright. I'm getting this star. It's over. I win. I want to do the baseball one real quick. <clears throat> God, the fastballs are so hard. Okay. Got him. You saw that? You saw that fan? You guys, you guys saw the fastball. You saw that fastball, right? Ooh, really good. Nailed it. Just gotta make sure that you look at the launcher. Holy crap. That thing went so fast. I hate that. Common W. 35 coins. Imagine this contains a star. And then the other one contains two stars. Holy crap, man. That was awesome. There we go. Screw you, CPU! <laughs> we going to... We going to Windmillville with the hotel gimmick, even though it's their windmills. <laughs> wonder what made them want to do windmills. wonder what made them want to do hotels. They switch from windmill to hotel, they're like, yeah, let's purchase windmills. 
Bell's been selling the winner is B Boo hoo Luigi <laughs> Alright what turn was that Was that the longest one No it's about the same time Well Pyramid Park felt like it took longer though Definitely felt like Yo guys we got 641 Oh my god This time this time guys this time This time dude Here we go Holy freaking crap Holy freaking crap! <laughs> oh my gosh! It's time! <laughs> I'm so freaking happy! <laughs> oh my god, I've been waiting! Fuzzy sheep! Free him! Yes! Yes! I love you, Fuzzy Sheep. Look at him. Look at how fuzzy everyone loves this. Look, it says everyone loves this Fuzzy Sheep. Hearts in the chat for Fuzzy Sheep. Why, you ask? Surprise. I don't know what that means. Surprise. <gasps> when I said surprise, it... Yo, I didn't know. I, I just... I tested it. I tested it. And it actually did a... It did it. What? I didn't know that there were mic commands here. Surprise. Yo, that's so cool. I didn't know that was a thing. Surprise. What? Dude, I played Mario Party 7 for so long. I didn't... You can hit R as well. It's not working. Hold on. Uh, let me try the other buttons too. Uh, it didn't work for me. Surprise. Oh my gosh, the cake. Okay, we're done. <laughs> oh, he even... Surprise. Is he bad? Bad? Oh, that's so cute. Oh, this was so worth it. This was so worth it. Oh my gosh, I love this. Dude, this fuzzy sheep is awesome. Look at him. Look at his horns. Holy crap, he's so cute. We need to get him a friend once we do the next one. Man, that was awesome. Oh, R when the mic is off. Okay. Okay, I got you, I got you. Yo, that's awesome. Okay. That sheep is incredible. I love him. Alright, so we fought against Yoshi on... We fought against Yoshi on the first one, Daisy on the second one, Boo on the third, Luigi on the fourth. Now... I want to fight either Wario or Waluigi. So this time we're going to do a poll. Hey, thank you, Prestige. Fuzzy Sheep face cam. Dude, I need... You, you, okay, you know one of those... um, What is it? You know one of those cams that people do? What are they called? Fan cams. Dude, I need a fan cam of Fuzzy Sheep. I need a fan cam of Fuzzy Sheep. If you make one, I'll, I'll retweet it on Twitter, dude. I, I, I need a fan cam of Fuzzy Sheep so bad. <laughs> that sheep is so cute, dude. I love him. Okay, so I'm going to... I'm gonna do a poll real quick. How do I make a poll? When the fuzzy sheep low poly, yo, fuzzy sheep and low poly monkey would go crazy. Okay, 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 okay. Here we go. Okay. Eh, eh. Let's see here. All right, guys. I just set up a poll. Thank you so much for the donations, by the way. Alright, so it's between Wario and... Wait, where did that... How did that get there? Oh, no. No, guys, wait, no, I didn't mean it! Someone... Okay, no, no, we're fine, we're fine, we're okay, we're okay. We're okay, why is it split? It's split three ways! It's split three ways! There's 600 of you in here, and it's split three ways. One vote really does matter that much right now. Holy crap. Why is Toad here? Oh. Toad won! <laughs> Toad's gonna win. Once it gets to 400 votes. Once it gets to 400 votes. We're at 280. It's going up by 20s. You guys still have a chance? I don't even know if we need to wait for 400 votes. No. No. This is, this is impossible. How did Toad take that from everybody? That's the spoiler effect. Most people wanted Wario and Waluigi. A greater percentage of you wanted Wario and Waluigi, and yet Toad gets picked. That's the spoiler effect in action, baby. 
Let's go, Toad. <laughs> this was my plan all along. We have to keep going till we get the Toadster. Not Boo. Oh, Waluigi, get out of here. You didn't win. Daisy, we already played with you. Boo! Screw you, Stinky. Toad. You! Time to kill you. Hmm. I wonder... I wonder if the gimmick for this is going to be purchasing the three-star windmill. They're destroyed! That would be my guess. Because I think the biggest thing in this is a three-star windmill, so... I think it's going to be purchasing the three-star. And, like, maybe they'll make it so the junctions aren't there. Oh, you have to repair three broken windmills. Okay, so it's not exactly what I said. To fix them, stop in front of one, deposit coins. <clears throat> you repair regular-sized windmills for 30 coins. And the large windmill can be fixed for 50. Deposit the required amount of coins in the windmill to make it yours. Oh, wow. Once a windmill is repaired, you are the permanent owner. Deposit your coins carefully. Watch windmills other players pick and deposit how many... Oh, yeah. To win, fix three broken windmills before anyone else. Okay. Oh, before anyone. So that means... Interesting. Interesting. Okay, so that means that... Three? So if I just get the least value one... Oh, there's a windmill icon. That's cute. I know that was a thing. Uh, this is going to be a little weird. This is going to kind of be like the Pagoda Peak one, where coins are going to matter a crap ton. And that's a little scary, considering uh, we can't really choose the junctions as much. Dang, these windmills are destroyed. Like, really destroyed. Bowser crushed them. Since this is Mario Party 7, you should have gone with the option no one voted for. Nah, nah, I'm not that mean. When have I ever gone for the option that no one's voted for? Or, you know, the one that uh, no one votes for at all. I've never done that. <laughs> Alright, Toad. Let's see you go, man. You suck. You are, gar you are so disappointing, Toad. What an absolute disappointment. If it costs 20 coins, is that the amount... Oh, I know, yeah, I, I, I just fixed it before Toad, right? Okay, I'm gonna place Hammer Bro one space away. Hopefully I get some coins. Please, please get some coins. No, I didn't get any coins. A one? No. Oh, wait, that's still good. I have 20, so I can purchase the windmill. Okay, we're playing to the end of Solo Cruise, by the way. So this one, and then after the next one, we will be done. And then I'll have some links to share. And if anyone wanted to join the Discord server, I'll drop that link and everything. So make sure you stay to the very end for the link there. Discord server is hype. Yes! Yes, screw you, Toad. This is mine. Oh. Well played, you're the proud owner of this windmill. I'm pretty happy about that. And now, we have two to go and there are six left. Okay. And now, I can steal coins from Toad. Except... Wait, what? I can? Is he actually gonna let me? The winner gets a turn. Wait, I have zero coins. Wait, why is he letting me? That's very strange. That's... Huh. I, I don't understand that. I have zero coins. Why is he letting me do it? It's only if your rival has zero. Yeah, but then they can't... No, no, no. I, I understand I landed on it, right? I get that, but... No, no, because Toadsworth's last statement was, like, a duel without stakes, what rubbish, or whatever, right? But there are no stakes for if Toad wins. He can't steal anything from me. Like, that's so stupid. So, like, Toad has to play this in order to not lose anything? Because, like, in no Mario Party game before... Where someone, if someone has zero coins, you can't duel them. Like, let Toad win. He can steal a windmill. I'm gonna let him win. I'm gonna let him win. I'm curious. I'm curious what happens. I haven't seen it before. Come on, Toad, get all of them. Come on, Toad, get all of them. Hold on a second. Can I stay still in the teleporter? No, I cannot. Toad, you got this. 
We're gonna let him get all of them and we're gonna see what options arise. Finish. Bup. Bup intensifies. <laughs> yeah, more like Tass. No, he's terrible. Toad is awful, dude. I don't know why you guys chose Toad. It was Wario, Waluigi, and then Toad snuck his way onto the pole and you guys voted for him. Okay. Great fluffy biscuits! Mario has no coins! God! I didn't see that before! Man, it's so stupid! You got no coins! This is so dumb! Holy crap! So sorry, Toad. <laughs> it's almost like Toadsworth feels bad. Yeah, Toadsworth is a hack, man. Screw this guy. Okay, which way are you going? Uh, left. Ooh, he's kidding. He won't be able to purchase that windmill, though. No, that's okay. Yeah, no, he won't be able to purchase it. Um, too bad, old chip. I love Toadsworth's design, dude. Toadsworth is so cool. You want to see me duel with light speed blindfolded? Holy crap. That sounds like a terrible experience. I love it. That'd be awesome. Yeah. <laughs> I love the Koopa here. Yeah, you're gonna need extra coins, okay? Yeah, just a little short. <laughs> I don't know why it comes off as like so mean. Too bad, old chip. Thank you. Man, I could really use a hidden block right about now. Too bad there's nothing. How do you get the cursed mushroom as a green orb? I think it might be in the next board. I guess we're gonna have to see. Ooh, he gets this one. I really want to get the, the three-star windmill. So on my next turn, which is going to be in a few seconds, I'm just going to check the map. And we're going to see what the tulip path looks like. Maybe I... No, I didn't have enough coins to buy anything in the shop. It comes off as mean because it is mean. Yeah, no, you're right. Oh, man. He got the trample leaf. He's going to get so much from this, dude. He managed to get them all. give you a special present. Let's see how good Toad does in this. He'll probably get... He missed the coin bag. Okay, he's garbage. Oh, man. Oh, yeah. Oh, t just terrible. Holy crap, Toad. Your reaction time is atrocious. Three coins? Dude, landing on a blue space would have been better. Why am I so mean to these CPUs? Oh, wow. You can actually make it there. The, the path is available. You guys can see it right here on the map. You can see that the arrows lead to the... To the... Windmill in the middle. Even if it wasn't, though, I probably, if I had enough coins, would have chanced taking this over there as well. Eight coins. Not enough. Unless I get 30 here. Ooh, 20. That's fine. I don't think there was... Was, was 30 an option? Ooh, and I can duel him for more coins. We might be able to lock this up here. If I get... Okay, if I don't, then I'll just purchase the, the windmill right in front of me. But if I do get a lot of coins here, I think I might chance going for the one in the middle. Because he's right behind me. And unless he uses whatever green orb he has to, like, burst ahead, we should be fine. I'm not sure what he has. Right? Regardless, I mean, he might have a metal mushroom. I totally forgot. But whatever. Again, these CPUs are pretty bad at this. Although, again, this is a really good test to see what difficulty they're on. Because the difficult or the brutal CPUs or intense CPUs are really good at like recognizing what buttons they have to press and doing it instantly. Ooh, like Toad is here right now. Toad was really fast there. That was much faster than the other CPU. I think they increased the difficulty. I could be wrong. Maybe this this Toad's just built different. He almost kept up with my pace. <clears throat> wow. No, a toad scream is amazing. Because the other ones, I believe, uh, I don't know if it was Luigi or someone else, where they were bouncing like a couple times beforehand, but Toad here was actually doing one bounce and going. It was a little scary, yeah. But they tend to mess up a little bit. Yes, I got 10 coins. Dude, I'm so happy I'm not getting duds anymore. Dude, duds are in the past. No more. No more duds. But, see, duds were annoying, like here, or are annoying still, here in the solo cruise, but they're even more annoying in party cruise. You want to guess why? Because here, I don't have the ability to gain any stars, right? It's just coins, right? But with the stars option, right, that means that the dud is even less likely. So if I get a dud, that means, one, I was more unlucky, and two, I missed out on a star. So, whatever. Okay. I haven't been stinky enough, you're right. Hey, 
stinky. Hey, stinky. Hey, stinky. Hey, stinky. <laughs> Oh, Toad! No! Toad! Why'd you do this to me? Bowser, ratio him! Send him to the office and have him expelled! No! Just... It's all your guys' fault! If I didn't hate Stinky, Bowser wouldn't be hurting me right now! Can I hate Stinky right now? <gasps> guys! Wait, wait, okay, okay, I, for I forgive you guys real quick, but, but look! Look in the back! The sheep! It's the same model! The sheep! Look in the back! Treasure Dome. Those are all of his friends. I need to land on them. I need to land on the sheep, you guys. I don't know if I'm going to be able to. Crap, the fuzzy sheep. Oh, half of your one coin? Wait, did he say half? Wait, what's going to happen? I've never seen that before. Oh, I really hope Toad loses this. Good. Good. Oh, bad pathing. Oh, we love to see it. Oh, no. Darn. Yes. Nice. No, come on. Come on. I want to see it. Okay, good. Come on. Please don't be it. Please don't be it. No. He wins this. Oh. Wait. No. Come on. I was doing with bated breath. With bated breath, dude. I thought it would count down to zero in time. It was on one. Holy crap. He was so close with that. Holy crap, dude. His pathing was so bad. No, I really wanted to see what would have happened if it was half. You think Bowser will just take the coin? But that's funny because, like, that's not half. He takes all of the coins. It's technically incorrect, is what I mean. Like, they should have programmed it. If you have one coin, he can never say half. It'll always be all. But that he's technically wrong. That, that's what's so interesting about that. Um, I guess I can get the one over there. I'm going to throw the hammer, bro. Let's throw it right after the block here. Half rounded up. <laughs> no, that's stupid. Half of one is not... Half of one rounded up is one. That's so dumb. I mean, I'm not going to say you guys are wrong, but it's still stupid. The windmill already belongs to Toad. Whatever. Should I... No. Toad can't... He can't get there. All I have to do is purchase this windmill on the right and then the windmill down below. This is, this is it. We got this. We got this. We're good. I can purchase this, and if I get 20 from this... Ooh! Man, this is, this is in the bag. Fastest one we've ever played so far, you guys. In the bag. We got the one in the bottom right corner. We got 20 coins from that. We're able to afford it. Unless I land on something completely unfortunate and something I didn't, you know, see or whatever. We, we're good. In dead heat. Yeah, right. Oh, a duel. Okay. We're, we're good. We're still fine. It's ogre. It's ogre, dude. Give me Warpipe Dreams. I love Warpipe. Guys, the sheep. Guys, the sheep. Look at the sheep. Look at it! Look at the sheep. I can see you're not looking. You're not listening to me. Look at the sheep in the back there. It's cute, isn't it? It's so fuzzy. Oh my gosh. Look how fuzzy it is. I want to hug a sheep. I've never hugged a sheep before. Gosh darn it. I want to hug that sheep. We have to go back to the sheep after this, you guys. We have to go give him a friend. We need to get him a friend, you guys. We need to get him a friend. Uh-oh. Okay, you guys remember this one? The three kinds of cheap cheeps. One of them goes down all the time. One of them goes diagonal, and one of them follows you. We haven't seen any ones that follow yet. Okay, there's the diagonal one. Okay. Oh, here's one that follows. You guys see it right above Mario? I'm going to go around it right now. Yeah, that one was following. I didn't catch it fast enough, though. I was too occupied with the diagonal ones, but I saw it just in time. There we go. <clears throat> now, hopefully, we get a coin from this. Yes! Half! Oh wait, guys! Half of a coin! Here it is! Oh! <laughs> That's so stupid, half of a coin. That's so dumb. No dud. Why are you guys- You guys are mean to me. You guys really want me to suffer that much? A dud? Come on! We already suffered earlier with the dud. Guys, even if it was a dud, it wouldn't have even done anything. Toad had one coin. Do you guys like the duds that much? I can see. Okay, maybe. If- 
if there were like 50 coins on the line that I could have stolen from Toad or a star, then I can see you guys going, oh man, we got to get this dud in here. Zoom Zyke, it's going to be really funny. He had one coin, guys. <laughs> he had one coin. Yeah, one coin's basically a dud anyways. Screw you. We're good. I think we win these. Oh my gosh. I'm going to land on the freaking mic space and we're going to get screwed over again. That's what's going to happen. I don't even suffer from losing or getting a single coin. You know what? Getting a dud would have made me angry regardless. I think you guys might be a little right on that. <laughs> on that. I don't think it would have mattered, honestly. Uh, there you go, Toad. You got this. You got this. Oh, man. Mario, go. Let's a freaking go, Mario. I'm just gonna throw this here for lols. Because I don't give a crap. I'm just gonna throw it there. Eh, eh. Easy W. I think it's done. Are we done here? We win? We win? We gaming? We did it. I'm the proud owner. I'm the proud owner of this windmill now. That's the game! Mario's the winner, fair and true. Fair and true indeed. Yes. Guys, guys, oh my gosh, we're gonna be able to get someone for this sheep. We're gonna get someone for this sheep. Oh my gosh. Amethyst says, bro, I just started Solo Cruise for myself because I haven't played seven in a while. The blooper happening in Grand Canal is cruel. No, yeah, we saw that earlier. Boo-hoo. Not to you, I appreciate you for donating, but no, you know. 52. 52 turns total? Guys, it's time. Guys, it's time. Oh, wait, what's going on? An invitation from Bowser. It's me, Bowser. Weather is here. Wish you were great. <laughs> what does that even mean? Weather is here. Wish you were great. <laughs> so it means like, weather is great. Wish you were here. But he swapped the two. Weather is here, wish you were great. I've set up a special tourist trap just for you. Come see it. A tourist trap. Oh, you. He's pointing to you guys. Just you guys. Yeah, he got a little bit backwards. Weather is here. <laughs> 591. Why was that less? I completed it in a shorter amount of time. Maybe that's why. No. Guys, it's time. Guys, it's time. We gotta get a friend. Everybody, we gotta, we gotta choose a friend for the sheep. We need to choose a friend for the sheep, okay? I don't... Okay, okay, hold on. Who's right next to the sheep? How do we know who's going to be right next to the sheep? Hold on, does it say? Maybe? Oh, no, it doesn't. Who's next to the sheep? Maybe it's just simply whoever we purchase next to it. Oh, man, is it... Oh, man, it's probably these two. Man. Who's friends with the sheep? Who's friends with the sheep? Hmm. D -d Does Dry Bones like sheep? I'm not very sure. I think it's time to ask. Hmm. Alright, guys. I'm putting up a poll. Do you guys think Dry Bones like sheep? <laughs> we have to decide. Does Dry Bones like sheep? Because if we don't know, then we can't make this purchase properly. We already got Annoy Mode. We already have Brutal for the next stream. Because that's going to be a lot of fun. We, we got what we needed. Is there anything I'm missing for the next stream? Dry bones like sheep? You guys think so? Ooh, okay. I mean, if you guys say so, let's do it. You swapped it for dry bones. We can now use dry bones. We have freed him, everybody. Finally. He has been freed. I guess he does. For those of you that said no, he doesn't like sheep. Why? Why doesn't he like sheep? What's the reason? Give me your logic, if you will. <laughs> Sensational! You've arrived! He adores sheep. Alright, so, I'm just- Yeah, our opponent's dry bones. We're gonna make it dry bones. If we can- If we can make it dry bones, I hope we can. Alright. We're gonna make it set. Executive decision. We're making it dry bones. If he shows up. If, if I do this like a hundred times, then- here we go. There he is, guys. There he is in all of his glory. The boat. I was about to give him a name, but I 
I stopped myself. <laughs> oh man. The bone enator. Let's let's go with that. <laughs> let's go with that. Crap. The bones. No, I won't go on. We're okay. Bowser's enchanted inferno with an exclamation point to boot. All right, what do you got for us? Oh man, we've somehow entered Bowser's Enchanted Inferno. Don't know how that happened. And it's not enchanting at all. Should I teach you? Yeah, okay. You need to beat Bowser to win in this, er, uh, fun land. But you must collect a star before you can challenge our arch nemesis. The rules for getting a star are the same as when you played Party Cruise. Just travel around the four islands and pay coins to get the stars. I've never done Party Cruise. But do be careful sometimes. Yeah, Bowser with that, you'll sink it. Does that mean that there's Bowser time here? I guess so. Once you have your star, head for the center island. If you make it, you'll face off against Bowser in a special minigame. What center island? Bowser beats you. Is that the one below us? That's the bottom island. Oh, just collect more stars. I'll repeat it for your sake. Beat Bowser to win. Okay. All right, now we go first. Yeah, look at that, dude. Look at that. You have half of my roll. You took the one out of my ten. <laughs> the skeleton in sheep's clothing? No. No. It'll be okay. It'll be okay. Okay, the stars spawn over here. Now, I'm gonna have to pause real quick to show you guys another correction, another error I made. It's not like a blatant error, and it's not... It's it's not necessary. There are multiple kinds of errors in Identify and Luck. There's like three of them, I would say. One where it's like an error that doesn't really matter, because like in Mario Party 2, I accidentally repeated myself the same line. It doesn't really matter for like the information I give, right? The second error is misinformation, where I say something and it's just flat out wrong. And the third is when I accidentally leave something out. The errors I had most of the time in this identifying luck was was something I left out. So in this case, there are two stars on each island. There's two here, two here, two here, and two here. Except I forgot to show this one on the board. Like this one does not show up. So I, I kind of feel bad for that because the star maps are supposed to be super accurate. I messed it up. One day I'll have like a big video correcting everything that they will not be today. Dude, two tens in a row. Oh, wait. We just visit the middle island, like, right here. Oh, okay. All right, that makes sense. Oh, you can visit it multiple ways. Huh. I don't know how this works. I guess I have to... Well, I definitely do just obviously have to get a star first. I wonder how quickly I'm able to... How many stars do I have to get? Once you get a star, challenge Bowser to a showdown. Okay, okay. No! No! Please! You can't do this to me! Oh man. Okay, this isn't... Eh, that wasn't too bad. Darn, I really wanted to speedrun this too. That's unfortunate. I guess it'll be okay. Man. Is Boo gonna... Not Boo, I called him Boo. <laughs> It's because they both have the deathly appearance. It's kind of interesting because you have Boo and Dry Bones who are both like... It's kind of like he's like undead and Boo's like... Is Boo kind of undead? Do you consider Boo undead? He's a ghost, right? I don't know. Luna, thank you for the donation. The best part is when Dry Bones says it's boning time and bones all over the truck. <laughs> uh, I don't know if he says that. I mean, it'd be kind of cool if he beats us and he says it's boning time. <laughs> Nintendo has put weirder things in their games. I would not put it past them, okay? Alright, wait for it here. I'm just gonna assume that he's a brutal CPU right now. Or at least a hard one. I forgot. Is a... Hey, that wasn't very nice. I did what I told you guys not to do. Okay, this is kind of brutal so far, so let's... I'm gonna have to hit him. Okay, hold on. You're mean. No, I have more on my side. I got distracted. I was I kept freaking talking about his stupid bones. I got distracted by his smooth, well-structured, muscular bones. His bones are nice. His bones are nice. I mean, look at him, dude. Look at dry bones. Dude, like, look, if you were a bone person, you would probably be attracted to dry bones. I'm just saying, all right? Look at him. Like, what a stud. I mean, can you imagine anyone looking more handsome than Dry Bones if you were, like, a bone person or something like that? How can your bones be muscular? Ask him! I don't know how he did it! Five. 
Oh, he's gonna get the star. This is really bad. Uh, no, I don't want this. Okay, star spawn. Oh man, I'm gonna hope it spawns up here. I'm just gonna hope it spawns up here, dude. So I can get to it first. I got 10 coins too. A bone person? A skeleton. Well, you have a skeleton, but like if you were to, you know, whatever. I'm just gonna do this, all right? Dry Bones is gonna make progress in the boss, yeah. I got freaking... I gotta stop reading chat during some of these moments, dude. Like, during the moments where I actually need to focus and make sure I got it, dude. I li Look, I like interacting with you guys, what can I say? Honestly, it didn't really even matter, if I'm, if I'm being real with you. I'm at 30, we just gotta hope that the star pops up on the left island regardless. There's a 1 in 7 chance that it pops up exactly where I want it to, and... You know, a one in six chance that pops up elsewhere. But like, like even closer. Like in the top. Oh? Yo! Holy crap! Nice! Nice! Beautiful! Wait. Are we over to this island? No! Oh, wait. He's got to get there. He's got to get there. Wait, can he fight and lose? Oh! <gasps> Bring him on? He can do it? Where did the freaking bridge come from? Oh no. Oh no. I see you brought that star, Bobby. Fine, let's get this over with. I'm a busy man. Is he gonna... Bowser's lovely lift. Spoilers? Spoilers? Holy crap! Look at this guy! Can we bet on if Bones will beat Bowser before you can or not somehow? No. Dude, Dry Bones is here. He's revolting. I can't believe he's actually doing it. If he does, I auto lose? Well, how does he lose? Does he just have to get hit? Three, seven. Yo, he's avoiding them kind of nice. Yo, I kind of want him to win. Does the game beat by... Yeah, right? Like, can he win on his own? Come on, Dry Bones. Let's go. I want to see it. I want to see Dry Bones win this. Let's see. Let's get the credits. Oh, man. He went up pretty high there. He went... Where is he? It seems like he's at like 22 or so. Yo, Dry Bones is... Dry Bones is crazy. Unless Bowser starts switching things up, I think he's going to be able to avoid all of these. Oh, wow. Oh, my gosh. Oh. Is he... He's, he's almost... If he gets this, he'll be over halfway up. Dude, it, no! No, Dry Bones! No! No! You were so... Dude, you were halfway there! Dang! I really wanted to see him win now, honestly. I'm surprised. Yo! Star. Dry Bones, no. We gotta win it for you, Bones. Don't worry. I'll take it home. I mean, technically, you lose if I do it, so it's kind of weird for me to say I'm doing it for you, but... Irregardless. <laughs> or, regardless. <laughs> We're just gonna make our way around a little bit. Just in a little circle. Mario likes the circle. We could go around, have the bridge appear out of thin air. Where's Drybones gonna go? Is he just gonna get off the right bridge again? I guess we'll see. Nice. Hurry over to this island. Yes, I, I am. I'm going to. I don't think that's the best design, though, by the way. I don't really like that. Okay. If you're playing this game for the first time... Okay. If you're playing this game for the first time, and you know you have to go over to this island, right? And you see that the bridge is over here... Then... Why would you go down? Right? Because it doesn't specify... I don't know if it tells you if going to this arrow causes a bridge to appear. 
or it's kind of hard. It doesn't really feel like that's intuitive, right? Like if I was playing this for the first time and didn't see dry bones do it first, I probably would have gone all the way around to where the bridge is right here, right? But the fact of the matter is, if you go right here, look at this, watch. Look at the bridge. It just appears out of nowhere. Like, I feel like that's a little unintuitive. The camera scrolls to the slowest arrow. Uh, uh, I mean, I know that, but I thought the arrow indicates it for like the bridge that it appears on. I guess it scrolls to it. Why not just have a bridge on all four sides? Yeah, right? Like, doesn't that... Let's see. All right. Do whatever it takes to move the elevator to the 100th floor, but watch for Bowser's attacks. Hmm, what do those four dice blocks do? All right, so we're gonna... We're gonna try and do what the, the bone stir could not. I'm trying to think of whatever cool title I could give him that wouldn't sound weird. Okay, we kind of saw... So those are three shots. Ooh, good luck on that. We got a six, we got a nine. That's nice. We got a three and a four. Ooh, there's even Koopa Kid stuff down. Are you freaking serious? Wait a minute. Am I already over halfway up? I'm already over halfway up because of what Dry Bones did. Is that fire? I'm scared. Okay, okay. Yo, I'm scared as crap. Dry Bones is about to take this from me. I'm soaking to die at the end. Okay. All right. You won't go closer. No, I jumped over it. Ah! I was so over that. I'm looking at the free. Oh, I got to look at that stream replay. Oh, I so jumped over that. I so jumped over that, dude. No way. No freaking way. I look back on that. Are you serious? Oh my gosh. That hitbox is stupid. I really thought that maybe I ran towards it and then jumped. Can't jump over the laser. Just make it a wall then. Oh my gosh. It was getting closer and closer. It really looked like you could jump over it. Because I thought they were going to keep getting closer and closer. And then I had to just jump over it or whatever. Oh my gosh. That was so stupid, dude. Screw his lasers. I can't believe it counts for both of us. So that means Dry Bones can win this. Dry Bones can win this. I'm scared. And Dry Bones is doing the Mr. Beast. <laughs> I love Mr. Beast. Now we have to bridge work. Oh. Oh my gosh, dude. This is terrible. Die. Die, potato. Die, dry bones. I'm gonna keep jumping on your head. I'm gonna keep jumping on your head to screw with you. Because it's funny. Whoa! Holy crap. Got him. <laughs> Got him. Okay, good. I reduced the amount of coins he had to purchase another star, but holy crap. My lordy. Can I hurt Dry Bones in a way that matters? I suppose not. Yes, I got- Can I get all the coins, man? I just want all of the coins. Am I a Zoomer Zyke or a Boomer Zyke? I guess I'm closer to Zoomer Zyke. <laughs> uh, I, am, I am not a Boomer Zyke. Uh, most of the Mario Parties- Not most. Mario Party 1, 2, and 3 were born before I was- Or came out before I was born. Bridge work ahead. I sure hope it does. <laughs> Oh wait, I can actually- Thanks for the donations, by the way, guys. I really appreciate it. I just had to make sure that I placed this in the right spot. Okay, good. Now it's not just a lame red space. It actually does something this time. I just gotta work my way around... ...to the star. Okay, I should be able to reach it first. I should be fine. I should be all good. Oh, there we go. See, good placement there, huh? Well, <laughs> I'm young. Someone said that. Like, when I was ma when I made the first Identifying Luck, um, I'm 24. But when I made the first Identifying Luck, it was the, uh, what was it? I was like 21, maybe 20 when I first made it. Yeah, no. I, uh, I forgot when Mario Party 4 came out. Let's see. 
Yeah, we can head our way around to the right. <laughs> and then if we go one, two, three, four, five. Ooh, okay, we'll get Blaze a little bit, but that should be fine. I sound like I'm 30. You have no idea how many people I've spoken to. Because my voice, you can look back on very old Zooms like videos. I think I have some of them enlisted, but you could look back. My voice got this deep around when I was like maybe like 17, possibly. It doesn't sound like that in the mic or whatever, but a lot of people thought I was older than I was, and they're like, oh, you're like 16, 17. You sound like you're in freaking 50 or something. Not, but yeah, I'm like, I'm like early Zoomer, whatever that may be. Dry Bones is not making this, by the way. Unless I royally screw it up again. If there's like some kind of final phase I don't know about. Which one was that? Oh no. Wait, what? No! What? Where did that come from? What? That was supposed to be the Klepto. I mean, it still would have sucked, but come on. Oh my gosh. I hate Bowser. I should have checked, man. I even knew that this doesn't have Bowser time, and I should have looked around. Okay, that's not too far away. A sticky wicket. What does that even mean? Okay, okay. Uh, in that case, why is the mm, the bridge spawned over here? Which is fine, but it's kind of bad because well, I'm three spaces away from the star. Ah, oh, I'm gonna have to head up. Because if I head for the star right now, I'm going to go in a weird circle. I think I save more time by going in a circle this way. Oh my gosh, wait, did I just... Did I just land on the cannon? I should have looked. No, I didn't. Oh, <laughs> Dude, I was so nervous I landed on the cannon. Oh man, I am so happy I didn't. Let's go. Let's pin Mario vs. Dry Bones. The winner gets a turn on the slot of stupendousness. Sounds good to me. Let's spin the Wheel of Whimsy to find what game will be played. So exciting! So exciting! Apes of Wrath! <laughs> Delicious apples. Let's do it. The intense CPUs and brutal CPUs absolutely suck at this minigame. What the heck?! <gasps> Actually, it scared me. What was Dry Bones doing there? Oh my gosh, dude. I can't. I need to see that again. I need to see that again. That. Oh, dude. I'm sorry if my scream scared you guys. That freaked me out. Holy crap. I didn't know that that happened. I didn't see that. I've never seen that before. I thought he was just. It was a custom animation. That's so cool. One coin. One coin. Oh yeah, one coin, let's go. I got one coin, you guys. Yeah, one coin! <laughs> it's not like Dry Bones is faring any better, though. He doesn't really have a chance at winning this. He should have gone for the coin block over there. Unless there's one in the bottom island. I just need to go in a circle. I just need to- No! Stop dueling me! I don't want to duel again. Please. Don't make me do it again once more. You only have one coin. Okay, come on, Toadsworth. Clearly, this is not a balanced duel. I have 23 coins. He has one coin. I have 23 times the amount he has. All of these suck. I don't like any of these dual minigames. I don't like Mad Props. Hip Hop Doctor is just... Hip Hop Drop. Hip Hop Doctor. <laughs> now I'm imagining Dr. Mario dancing when you walk into the examination room. <laughs> Hip Hop Drop here is fine. But if he's a brutal CPU, I'm in some trouble, actually, so I gotta focus. Go. He sucks. Not brutal. He's so bad. He's so bad, dude. Imagine losing this minigame. Kind of crazy. Couldn't be me. <laughs> 2701 each time, dude. I don't know if a faster time is possible. I think even if you hit it instantly, you have to wait for the bounce and then you go. Kind of like uh, kind of like the frame roll in uh, Super Mario Brothers. I'm not sure. I, I guess I would have to check that myself. I guess I didn't find it like important enough. Ooh, yes. Yeah. 
We reduce him down to zero. We love it. I don't even care. I don't even care, dude. 2701 is staff records. Oh, well, there you go. It's not possible. Okay. Uh, he's all the way over there. I'm just gonna throw down a freaking. Nah. I'll throw on a spear guy for the heck of it. Why not? Let's get some coins just in case. You never know. You never know, dude. No dud? Good. Good. Why are you saying that like it's a bad thing? Okay. Guys, we made it. Guys, we made it. We're gonna get the star. And then we can visit Bowser literally right afterwards. Oh, man. I don't wanna throw. I don't wanna throw. I can't throw. It can't be like this. Okay. It's not even in a good position for... Okay, good. Like, Dry Bones isn't even in a good position to grab that one. So even if I do lose, which I, which I won't, of course, but if I did in some alternate timeline, then we'd still be safe, probably. He's at zero coins, too. He's not coming back from this. Bring him on! And then the bridge just... Maybe they didn't have the programming to do all four. Who knows? Bowser, you were inches away of being defeated, dude. Inches away of being defeated, dude. Come on. You brought the star. What, what was so special about the star here? Okay. Here we go. Let's continue it. Okay. I'm staying still! I'm doing what you guys said. Okay. Alright. I stayed still. I was a good boy that time. I didn't hit it. Holy crap, holy crap, I just need to... Oh, Get away from me! We're at 100. We're at 100, we're good, we're good. Holy crap. The star! Now destroy him! Kill him! Yeah! Yes! Yeah, get, get Koopa Kid too! Yeah! I didn't get that many stars now. Star! I really wanted him to get sniped. Koopa Kid, why are you- Yeah! <laughs> We got him too. <laughs> nice. Obliterated. We did it. We did it. We obliterated the bones. He no! He He's dead. I didn't I didn't mean to kill him. Yo, this is like Super Mario Sunshine. Yo, this is just like Super Mario Sunshine. They defeat me again, Koopa Kid. I don't want to skip it. I'm a little... Oh, okay, okay, it is out of mid. It... It looks that way, Mr. Bowser, sir. Oh, look, Mr. Bowser! That's... <laughs> it's safety! It's rescue! <gasps> oh, you villain! Just you... <laughs> Why are you calling me a villain? Mario's like, yeah, you won't be invited... You won't be invited to the next one either! <laughs> I won't forget this. Mario really said. Yeah, you won't forget. You're gone, Koopa Kid. You never... I know you appear, I think, again. I don't remember. I guess this is kind of fun. <laughs> remember when I squashed that one guy? Oh, yeah, the boo. He did squash a boo. Or at some point. Something. Mr. Bowser, I won't lose next time. Bowser had fun. Look, Bowser, if you're able to withstand being on, a like, a, a planet that's, like, imploding or the end of the universe, all that Mario Galaxy stuff, I'm sure you can handle it. Battle's been settled. Boo-hoo! We killed Dry Bones. Record the results. 59. What do we got? What's our score? Well played! Dude, that's a caps. Well played, old bean! You cleared every board. Let me tell you how many turns you took on all boards and get a ranking. Here's a current ranking. First! Yeah! Wait a minute. Doesn't that just mean... Wait, I'm number one out of everybody, right? Like, like, I'm just number one out of myself? Change the chin. Yes! I'm a number one. Oof. I'm gonna put it to... Luck! Hold on. Luck. Identified. <laughs> My winning catchphrase. Luck identified. Luck identified. <laughs> So cheesy, dude. 
Only 576 points, dude. I've just beat the final boss of the game and you're barely giving me more than a freaking minimum wage. What? No, I'm good. Was that everything? Did I beat him up? Guys, it's time. It's time. We have to unlock. We have to do an unlocking. We need to get a friend for Fuzzy Sheep. Dry Bones doesn't even appear next to Fuzzy Sheep. <gasps> Wait, the Kung Fu Koopa is right below the sheep? Yes! Okay, guys, we'll get that. We'll get that. And then I'll give you guys the link to end all links. Kung Fu Koopa, you will be his friend. You will be the Fuzzy Sheep's friend. Yes! Okay. Now we'll go back. Yes! Fuzzy Sheep has a friend now! Did you do anything cool? Surprise! Ooh! Yes! He's so cool! Okay, hold on, hold on. Now we have to show the Fuzzy Sheep again. Surprise! He's so cool! I love this Fuzzy Sheep so much. I love him so much, dude. He's so cool. Okay, and now what I need to do... Because we are at the end of the stream, everybody. I am going to post... I'm going to post a couple things that you will find of great importance. That was a great stream. I appreciate all the donations. So the first thing I'm going to post is the link to the next stream. There it is. I just posted it in the chat. I will pin that. That is the link to the next stream. It's pretty cool. We're going to do it next week. So we're not going to do a stream on the weekday. It is set for Saturday, I believe. Yeah, Saturday for 1 p.m. That is on the 22nd. We are going to do Grand Canal. Grand Canal. You donate 99 cents. Thank you, dude. I really appreciate it. So make sure you set the notification for that. I am going to post my Twitter right here. Make sure you follow me for any kind of updates or dumb memes I post. And for the last thing, mods get ready for this one. If you've ever wanted to join my Discord server, now is the time. I am in PST, but it will show your time properly. So make sure you set your notification. It's your birthday, dude, on that? Yo, that's gonna be awesome. All right, here is the Discord server link for the Zyker Zone. We may do 50 turns. I will update that in the title if I decide to do so. So we probably will, is what that means. We're gonna do it on intense difficulty. It's gonna be great. There is the link to the Discord server. When you join, read the rules, have a lot of fun. Thank you so much for the donations. I love you guys. That's been a lot of, it's been awesome, dude. Look at the fuzzy sheep. Look at him. Surprise. Farewell. <laughs>